goodness more persona 3 today also y'all happy final fantasy 7 rebirth release week can you believe it can you believe we're almost there um i already posted this in discord but i won't be playing that right away but i'm like i'm just thinking about it i'm thinking about it a lot i think it comes out thursday it comes out on the 29th but holy crap we're so so close let me say my hellos to all of you though yang welcome in thank you for grabbing first Ooglog, congrats on grabbing second nina hello welcome in angie hello pettis welcome in kimchi don eb gamer thank you so much for the three months and thank you for using your prime here um duke welcome in sammy hi thank you so much for the 11 months Bryn, welcome in. Rai Guy, hello. Ideal, welcome in. I uh, love you. Hi. Magic, hi. Odney, Moraz, Spidey, Pepstrella, welcome in. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Uh, CBK, hello. Y'all, thank you so much for this hype train. Rin, welcome in. Gulicious, hi. Isaac, um, Saint Dreamer, hello. Good morning. Yes, rebirth week. It's more P3R week for you. Yeah, I'm curious. Are y'all trying to finish? Persona 3 if you haven't yet before you play Rebirth because like I said, that's what I'm doing um, But I feel like a lot of people might be like taking a break from Persona 3 to play Rebirth um, <clears throat> Also, uh, Satoru, hello, Giselle, welcome in, Athletic Gamer, hi Magic, you're taking Thursday and Friday off to play 7 Rebirth. I hope you have the best time. Oh my gosh. Um, Rin, you're trying. Rin, how far are you? How far are you in Persona 3 right now? You know, I was like, when we started Persona 3, I was like, okay, maybe, maybe I can finish this game <laughs> before Rebirth comes out, but that is not happening. We are in August right now. We just finished the fourth. I think it is the fourth full moon. Um... And so we're like, we're still at the beginning of August, but honestly, I feel like the months have been going by quicker now, especially July, like y'all, July and Persona 3 went by so fast. I don't know how that happened. Um, also, Tofu, hello. Dan Div, hi. Clove Buds, hi. Uh, Hugh, hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Megan, hello. Welcome in. How are you? Cosm, hi. Generally never been this scared of spoilers for anything than you are for Rebirth. Yeah, oh my gosh. This past weekend, I actually like put in a bunch of words in my muted terms list on Twitter. I'm like, okay, now is the time because I already heard that there were um, like spoilers going around and leaks going around for Rebirth. Like starting a week and a half ago, which is crazy. Um, but I'm like, all right, it's almost here. I should probably do this. Also, Mew, hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Hi, Breezy. How's it going? Try to say, how do you actually worry you'll overtake me this week? Oh my god, gang. Wait, how far are you? And Sammy, you're behind a persona. All you think and dream about, it's, it's so good. It's too much. <laughs> oh, wait, Yang, yeah, you're in September. Okay, I gotcha. Um, yeah, I feel like... I feel like we'll probably make it to September this week. I'm, I'm nervous about it, but I'm also very excited, of course. Also, H. Seki, hello, welcome in. So many spoilers are on. Honestly, I'm kind of surprised at that. Listen, I don't want to jinx myself, but my timeline on Twitter has been pretty clean. I don't know. Maybe it's because I haven't really been interacting with, like, rebirth stuff at all. Um, yeah. Another month of me avoiding Twitter altogether. No, literally, Giselle. That's another thing that I've been doing. I like haven't really been going on it as much as I usually do. Um, also, uh, Nisklin, hello, welcome in. 
Hi Chung, feel like Square Enix shared way too much info, do you think? I feel like that happens with a lot of Square Enix stuff. <laughs> like the trailers. I haven't even watched the last two trailers, I don't think. The last one I watched was the one that was on the Game Awards with the singing. Um, but yeah. Um, Jeremy, hello. Jeremy, thank you for grabbing your seat. Oh, trying to finish P3 Portable first. Okay. Tofu, are you playing um, the FMC route or are you doing the male protagonist route? So today you finally finished building your PC, right? That is so exciting. I wish you the best of luck. Oh my gosh. Oh, Kim, she been seeing them on YouTube. Okay. I see. Can we like Jutsu Kaisen where random people don't even follow or spoiling you? Yeah, I caused them. Okay, that happened to... That was happening to me with, with Jutsu Kaisen as well. I got spoiled on like one big thing that happened this past season and it was like a few years ago. <laughs> because this Twitter account, this Twitter account was popping up on my um, my timeline and I didn't even follow them and their their display name was a huge spoiler. It was like days since XYZ happened and I'm like, why? Why is this happening? Also, commonly, commonly, thank you for the 15 months. Back off my man, Tanaka. Listen. I don't want to talk about that. <laughs> I don't want to talk about Tanaka right now. Because I'm embarrassed. But good morning, how are you? Thank you so much for the resub. I appreciate that. Um, oh, Tofi, you're doing a male protagonist first. Okay. And then I break, and we'll return for Fantasy later. Gotcha. Kate! Kate, thank you for the 23 months! Welcome in! How's it going? Any chance I can see you do the Apollo Justice trilogy? I- okay, I would love to. That's Ace Attorney, right? I would love to play Ace Attorney. It's on my backlog. Um, I have no idea when I can get to that though, because I feel like this year is pretty stacked. Uh, because we're gonna be playing Rebirth next, and then we have Endwalker, and then I'm gonna be playing the 16 DLC as well. 13 Sentinels, maybe? Uh, Metaphor Re Zero? Wait, no. Metaphor Re Fantasia or something like that. Not Re Zero. Um,. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, Salvia, hi. Days, hello. Welcome in. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Is Tanaka the Gwink? No, he is not the Gwink. The Gwink is a different guy. Tanaka's a scammer. That's all I'll say about him. <laughs> Have you been playing for a while? You've run past me in game now. Oh, Pepstral, no worries. Yeah, we- I feel like I've been rushing through this game and I like- I want to slow it down. Um... Lord. Y'all, last stream... Last stream I feel like I may have pushed myself too hard with the- uh, with the Tartarus stuff. Um, and I need to remember to never do that again. Because it was bad. <laughs> I don't know if y'all could tell, but I was like... I was like, why? <laughs> why did I do this? Also, Amanda, hello, welcome in. Hi, Jeff, welcome in. Yes, yeah, someone said re zero. Okay, speaking of re zero, since I actually accidentally said that, um, I I think I'm gonna be starting re zero this week on Patreon, which I'm excited for. Let me let me just quick check the poll that I have on Patreon. When did I post that? Oh yeah, here we go. Yeah, I'm for sure gonna be starting ReZero, and I'm excited about that because I, I I'm all I'm all caught up with Free Run, um, but we'll see how that goes. I heard that there is a, another season of ReZero coming out, maybe this year or like next year or something. So I feel like this is perfect. Um, hi Trev, Trev, welcome in. How are you? Hi Mora, so when you see spoilers, you gaslight yourself into thinking you never saw them. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Exactly, Morris. Oh my god. I have been thinking about this. Do y'all remember the time that I got spoiled on Shadowbringers? Someone literally came into my stream during Stormblood and they spoiled me. Um, <laughs> it was like, it was a big thing too. And yet, I was still so affected by the thing that happened. 
<laughs> I forgot about um I forgot about that because I was gonna tell y'all like what I actually got spoiled on. I'm not gonna say right now, uh, just because there are obviously people here who haven't finished uh Shadowbringers, but yeah. I'm the exact same way, more rest. Also, QB, hello, welcome in. Um Next two or three years fill stacks, you're gonna try Yakuza. Oh, yes, like a dragon series. Yes, Tofu. And there's so many games in that series, right? Chris, hi, welcome in. Sydney, hi. How y'all doing? I never feel like love ReZero. Yeah, Kamalee's one of your favorites ever. Oh my gosh. And yet they lied? Yeah, I, I kinda. Kinda. <laughs> oh my god, excuse me. Astra, hello, welcome in. How are you? Chili, hello. It's good to see y'all. Did you all have a good weekend, by the way? Did y'all do anything fun? Please feel free to share if you would like. Um, I hope you had a nice, relaxing, restful weekend. Um, y'all, it's beautiful outside here in Wisconsin. It's like 60 degrees outside in February. Which is crazy to me, um, but it's almost March. So I guess it's like, it kind of makes sense, but yeah. Um, I had a pretty nice weekend. I went to my grandparents. I saw my grandparents this weekend and we celebrated my grandpa's birthday. He's 93. I think he does not look 93 though. It's crazy. And then my family, <laughs> My family, except for me, they all went to the casino yesterday. I'm like, I don't, I don't really want to go to the casino, <laughs> but they celebrated his birthday at the casino. <laughs> so that was nice. It was, it was pretty restful. Um, Jotharian, hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. How you doing? <laughs> Nini worked and played more Shadowbringers and didn't cry at all. No tears at all in your stream yesterday, Nina. Oh my God. You know, I'm so happy that you're playing through Shadowbringers. Um, I was in your stream and you were like, all right, I'm just gonna finish this quest and then I'm gonna end stream. And I was like, okay, I can stay up. I can stay up for like five more minutes. And <laughs> I fell asleep like 30 seconds later. But Nina, I hope you had a good rest of your stream. Also, musical hello, welcome in. Lamb, hello, caught up with the VODs, let's go. Lamb, I hope you've been doing well. Um, you told me what they said couldn't be, uh, like, yeah, but it was torture. <laughs> Trev. Oh, man. Also, Chelsea, hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Oh, Tofu, the drama, the drama in Yakuza. I can't wait to get to that because I would also like to eventually play the Yakuza series. I heard it's really good. Got to a fan early showing of Dune Part 2 in IMAX! Astra, how was that? In IMAX, that's crazy. I don't think I've ever seen a movie in IMAX theaters. I've always really wanted to see Interstellar in IMAX because that's one of my favorite movies. And I think it would be amazing on the big screen, but it's never happened. Jay, hello, thank you for grabbing your seat. Jeremy stayed inside and did some jigsaw puzzles. I love that, oh my gosh. I actually have a, a Ghibli puzzle out there that I've been meaning to do for like a year now. It's still in the box. Freeze, it's gonna be 95 degrees. 95 degrees, that's crazy. Remember like three weeks ago when it was freezing and you were worried about your pipes? What the hell? Um. Yeah, and you had a decent weekend, went up to your old town to see friends, nice, eat food, and you watched the entire Avatar live action series. Okay, how was it? Did anyone else watch Avatar live action? Because I was going to, and then I did not, um, because I'm kind of like getting obsessed with 14 again. <laughs> but I've been wanting to watch it, even though people have been like, mm, it's not good at all. I want to like, I want to test it out myself, you know? Um, Hi Nabs, welcome in. Been working this weekend. Every bookstore in your country has a big sale. Oh my god. That's crazy. Pepsi, I hope work hasn't been too wild for you. 
Uh, Kazaka, hello, welcome in. Nate, you won 2k at Ho Chunk Casino? When was this? Nate, that's amazing. Also, So Young, hello, welcome in. Man, I got to hang with a bunch of friends this weekend. Oh, now you're so tired. Your batteries run out, but I hope you had a really good time. Um, also, Afrit, hello. So Young, hello. Chris caught up to you and P3 this weekend. Can't wait to be back immediately. <laughs> no, seriously. I don't know. Chris, I don't know how much longer you streamed this weekend because when you finished the last full moon, I was like, all right, I got to dip. Um, yeah, I think I ended literally on the day that we came back from the full moon. So yeah. Also, I apologize. I'm like very far behind on chat right now. Musical, thank you so much for lurking. I appreciate that. Yes, Interstellar and IMAX is an experience, and that's why I wish I could have seen it. But I don't think it's ever gonna be coming back to theaters. Ra, you got the Sailor Moon figure, and it's going in your PC. I love that. Love the part where they said, wow, we are the Interstellar. <laughs> Me too, that's my favorite part of the movie. Also, Raz, hi. Merk for work, hello. Let's see. Did you start watching it yesterday, the Avatar live action? What do you think of it? Naps, thank you for lurking. I appreciate it. No 18th, hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Jeremy, it snowed on Sunday and immediately melted the next day. Because it was 60 degrees? Jeremy, actually, now that I think about it, I think it snowed here in Wisconsin too, a few days ago. And I looked outside because I wasn't expecting it and I was like, what the hell's going on? It was so strange. Wait your whole life for this, Astra. I love it. I love it so much. So you so you've like read the books and everything. And your personal opinion of ATLA was it wasn't terrible. Okay. Okay. Giselle, you watched one episode of Avatar and passed out. Your mixed reactions to it, some love it, some hate it. At the end of the day, only know if you like it or not. <clears throat> By watching it, exactly. <clears throat> I'm so sorry, you guys. I agree with that, QB. Because I see a lot of people like, <clears throat> I'm sorry, bandwagon hating it. And I'm like, all right. Uh, I, I don't know. I need to try it out myself before I'm like, yeah, this thing is the worst thing to ever exist, <laughs> right? But I don't know, I'm like, I am hesitant of it because the original creators of Avatar like dropped. So they're like, we are not going to be a part of this anymore. Um, so I am hesitant on that part. Also, I don't know. I don't know. Ori, hello, welcome in. Mad, thank you so much for the seven months. I really appreciate the resub. Thank you. Right, that's right. Sokka also, the actor for Sokka lied about being native. I don't understand that. I don't like that. Um, Chris, stop the day after you came back. Oh, so 8-8, eight, eight. okay. Spent my weekend waiting for the surprise Splatoon DLC stream. Oh my god, I need to play the DLC. I have not yet. Y'all, if y'all are new here, I'm... I was obsessed with Splatoon. I was obsessed with Splatoon 2 and Splatoon 3. The Octo Expansion DLC in Splatoon 2 is like one of my favorites. Favorite games ever. Um, and the new DLC for Splatoon 3 came out this past weekend and I have not played it yet. But I really need to because I've heard good things and it reminds me of Nier. It looks like Nier Automata, but... <clears throat> yeah, I don't think I'll stream it, unfortunately. Um, Cloudy, hello. Also, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. You might like the live action avatar since you've never seen the cartoon. Yeah, Jeb, I'm actually interested in what people's opinions are on the live action if they've never seen the cartoon. But Jeb, I highly recommend watching the cartoon version of Avatar. It's so good. Nina, I don't think you mind it noticing that the costume budget seems low. Yeah, yeah, Nina, I've heard, I've heard of that as well. I've heard specifically 
of people like noticing how much the wigs are standing out to them. Like people are like, they look like cosplay wigs. You know, like very low effort <laughs> cosplay wigs. <laughs> I don't know. Hi Pamster, welcome in. I am so sorry, I'm so far behind in chat. Um Seems like they crammed so much into eight episodes, which means a major loss of character development. Yeah, because the first episode of Avatar- not first episode, the first season of Avatar? That's like this first season of the live action, right? Um... And so the first season of the cartoon was what, like 20 episodes? So have to put that all in eight? It's kind of crazy. Saw a TikTok that compared the guitar from the Ember Island parody episode that comes before. Right. Right to the live action guitar. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, Rez. Rez, thank you so much for the 35 stream watch streak. I appreciate it. Say it once, I'll say it again. ATLA live action looks like cheapy, cheap person. Oh man. Also, Pokeball, hi, welcome in. Uh, Shy Yimmy, thank you for doing how I'm new. How you doing? It's good to have you here. Yeah, difficult thing to do live action for sure. Um, and like, I just, I don't know why these, these studios keep trying to make like anime or cartoon into live action versions. Like, sometimes. Most of the time, we don't need a live-action version of every single popular anime or cartoon. I don't know. Um... Also, Chris, thank you so much for lurking. I appreciate that. Jeff, I've been looking for something to distract you from your P3 brain rot. Yeah, maybe I'll watch the Avatars. Honestly, Jeff... Okay, I watched Avatar... Like, all the way through during the pandemic. Um and I became obsessed with it. I remember when I was younger, I watched like a few episodes when they were airing and stuff, um, but I didn't actually like follow the series. I will say the first season, the first season's like, okay, it's definitely like a, a kid's cartoon, right? But then you get to the second and third, it's like, holy shit, this is so good. <laughs> the story's amazing. I love it so much. Um. Yeah, just make original content, yeah. Um... It's been happening a lot lately, just like, there's always a bunch of remakes of... Cartoons, or... I don't know, they're... They're remaking movies. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, their Avatar Live remake did a better job customized. I saw that! I saw people comparing them. Um... Yes, oh my god, book three. Book three, my beloved. So good. Yeah, that episode. <laughs> episode is so good, Dancer Zuko alone. <laughs> What's the first anime you watched that got you into anime? Okay, Tofu. So here's the timeline. I watched Avatar Last Airbender. And I was like, okay, this isn't an anime, but I want to watch something similar to this, right? And so after that, I watched Cowboy Bebop. I don't know why. I think it was just on Netflix and I heard like really good things about it. So I watched Cowboy Bebop. And then after that, I watched Jutsu Kaisen and then Attack on Titan. So Cowboy Bebop was like my segue, my segue into anime. Stop making remakes. Yeah, and we're here playing P3 Reload. <laughs> Oopie! <laughs> and then we're gonna be playing um, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, <laughs> so... <laughs> also, Alexandra, hello! Uh, Kirstie, hello, welcome in! <laughs> Katie, hi! Comparing Avatar to other shows airing at the time, like Back at the Barnyard. Yeah, Avatar was so ahead of its time, it's actually crazy! And they touch on so many, like, so many important topics, right? I love it so much. I need to do a rewatch of the cartoon. It's in the low. Thank you for grabbing your seat. How are you? Not gonna bother checking out Cowboy Bebop live action. Yeah, I haven't either. Um, 
And it came out, what, last year? A year and a half ago? I don't know. Feels so cynical with the way studio execs care more about money rather than making good art. They'll invest in pre-existing IPs. Yeah, because it's safer, right? See, I feel like that's why I feel so excited about, um... Metaphor, the new game coming out by Atlas. That's completely brand new. It's a whole new IP. And I'm just like crossing my fingers that it'll look good. Hi, Nilla, welcome in. That's true, Astra. Yeah, the One Piece live action I heard was actually really good. Um, and I feel like people... People who haven't seen One Piece, or like haven't even watched anime, they watch the One Piece live action and they love it. Um, hi Leech, welcome in. I still haven't watched the One Piece live action. The chat cow was hot! <laughs> Drev, what? The chat cow? Let me look this up. From, uh, uh, back at the barnyard? What is a Chad cow? I don't know if I've ever watched back at the barnyard. I'm only seeing the, the main cow. <laughs> Hi Ventus, welcome in. You'll know him when you see him. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Um They dropped the ball with a cowboy bebop. Did wait, Kirsty, did you watch it? Cowboy Bebop should have worked in live action, I feel. Honestly, yeah. I could see it working in live action. I don't know if people actually enjoyed it though, unfortunately. One Piece live action is fun. Does kind of cut down some arcs by the core of the story. Yeah, skept intact. Yeah. Well, the creator, Oda, like worked really closely with the crew for the live action, right? And I feel like that's <laughs> that's like what these live action stories need. I don't know. Um. In the UK, they started adding One Piece anime episodes to Netflix. They started at episode 1089 and are adding new ones weekly. So they don't have like the whole backlog. That's so crazy though. Oh god, Katie. This is, this is. This is a Chad Cow? You gotta tell no. This is the Chad Cow. <laughs> I never feel like I don't I don't know about that, y'all. <laughs> Katie said, I'll know the Chad Cow when I see him. I saw this cow when I <laughs> <laughs> this is your king. <laughs> no, we can't do trip like this. We can't do that. We can't. <laughs> Sam, you have a crush on him. <laughs> oh my god. Oh lord. I. Wow. Well, I have nothing to say. <laughs> Oh my god. Are we ignoring Commonly's bark? Listen, I'm I'm seeing people barking. Sammy said she had a crush on him. Man. You're <laughs> funny, but you're blah. Jesus Christ. Um, each and every cast actor for the OP live action was spot and perfect. Felt the same for the ATLA cast. Oh, it's one of the live action of all time. Um, right, yeah, I'm so sorry. We're, we're talking about this Chad Cow from back at the barnyard. I don't know, maybe maybe has a nice personality <clears throat> in, in the show. God, what's wrong with my throat? 
Chad Cow's VA is Kevin James. Who is Kevin James? Should I know who this is? <gasps> oh! Paul Blart? <laughs> Paul Blart Mocha. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Paul Blart Mocha is the Chad Cow. That's funny. Oh my god. I was just saying, how do we get on this topic? But we were, we were talking about Avatar. And then we were talking about Back in the Barnyard. Um, hi, Lava First Bite. Welcome in. Ori, hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Who's barking at Paul Blart? I mean, someone has to, right? Nishiko, hello. Welcome in. There, Jev is. Jev is barking for Paul Blart Mall Cop. Wow. Um, <clears throat> started on fan subs in the early thousands. And funny say that they started with the current apps. Oh, oh, so you like missed all those in between episodes, Astra? I see. I'm from someone who found the beast and beauty of the beast. Oh, hotter. <laughs> when he went back to you and no sammy because the way that what's her face who's the who's the princess and in, in and the beast bell her name's bell the way bell is also looked upset when he went back to human okay <laughs> so <laughs> his little security segue goes we woo we woo crazy please <laughs> I don't blame her. Oh my god. Bell, Bell, the origin of furries. Lord. Y'all, I can't deal with this conversation at 10 30 in the morning. Yeah, she's like, This is you? Why? So, someone read Color Prince added with Melon, and he kind of is like, Oh, I bet. I'll see you. Hi, hello. Welcome in. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Man. I I'm trying to think of like childhood crushes that I had when I was younger. I was like I had such a big crush on um Flynn. Flynn Ryder from um Tangled. I loved him so much. Furry started in France, yes. All the way back then. We're talking about Chad Cow, yeah, and the beast being hot, just Regular conversations. Had a crush on Danny. Yes, Danny Phantom. Yeah. Oh my god. And Jet from Avatar. Wait, Jet. Oh, Jet. Yes, Jet. He. Okay. He reminds me so much of um. Spike. Spike Spiegel. Is that what they based him on? Jet, Avatar, Spike Spiegel. He was for sure based on Spike Spiegel from Cowboy Bebop. Um, Simba from The Lion King, y'all. I I was not into Simba, but also, um, I don't ever really remember watching The Lion King when I was younger. Gilbert, hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. And she didn't realize it at the time. Definitely had a crush on Ty Lee. Oh my god, Ty Lee's so cute. Is France real? <laughs> Arthur, please. You can't ask that when we're about to go see Bebe in Persona 3. Of course France is real because Bebe's from there. <laughs> um, Missy from Pokemon or... Oh, Jasmine from Aladdin. I also loved... um. Oh god, I'm forgetting all these names, y'all. Aladdin. No, his name's Aladdin. <laughs> okay. I loved Aladdin. Um, oh, guys, I also had a huge crush on um, Peter Pan. Peter Pan in the live action of Hook. I think in like 2000... Did that come out in like 2003? I... 
was obsessed with him. I was obsessed with that actor. Man. Not Robin Williams. No, 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 no. The, the, the blonde kid. Okay. I don't remember if it was Hook or if it was called Pan. Peter Pan movie? Jeremy Sumter! Guys, it was Jeremy Sumter. I feel like every girl had a crush on Jeremy Sumter as Peter Pan. She was just so cute. Um... Hook Peter Pan or Tumblr Peter Pan? Katie, Katie, I, I was a part of that. I was a part of that obsession with a Peter Pan actor in Disneyland. And I'm embarrassed. I see Manda and Chelsea also were. Because we're, we're the same people, okay? Manda, Chelsea, Katie, and I were all the same person. Um, the Tumblr Peter, Peter Pan Giselle, you know about him. I know, where is he now? I don't know. Um, hi, Youthful Eagle, welcome in. Disney live action remake from last year was garbage. I haven't seen it. I haven't seen, like, any of the, the Disney remakes. Only crush on fictional boys and men? Oh, Jeff. Robin Hood was one of those movies you wore the VHS out on. I don't remember watching Robin Hood when I was younger. Um, the actor for Jet in the live action? <gasps> I'm gonna have to- I need to watch it just for that. <laughs> Simply for blogging, yes, 1D edits and Peter Pan pictures. That was my life. One Direction, Peter Pan, Glee. I loved Cory Monty from Glee as well. I was obsessed with him. Um, not as obsessed as my sister was. My sister had Cory Monty's pillowcases. I'm sorry for exposing her like this, but <laughs> she had Cory Monty with Glee pillowcases. Was too busy with Larry on Tumblr. Who's Larry? Don't say that, Arthur. Oh my god. Um, the Beauty and the Beast live action is pretty solid. Luke Evans as Gaston, that's right. Imagine if Himmel was the first man you encountered became a standard for all men. Listen, everything would be downhill, Choco. <laughs> Honestly. Sammy, you were a Maycon girl. Okay, listen. I can't judge because I was an O2L girl. Um, O2L on YouTube. Anyone with like Key and Lolly. Um, JC Kalen. Who are the other ones? Connor Franta? I loved O2L. H2 actors, he had a huge crush on. And, oh, as well as Jamie Lynn Spears and Zoe 101. I miss H2O. Oh my gosh. Also, Clay, hello. Welcome in. You're obsessed with Glee for a brief period. Yeah, I love Na Naya Rivera. She was so great. Ricky Dillon. Yes, Ricky Dillon, too. <laughs> Nash Greer. Not Nash Group. I haven't heard that name in ages. Wow. Um, first celebrity crush was ooh Jesse McCartney. Sammy, yours is Ross Lynch. Ross is so cute. Katie, yes. Joey Graceffa's original Hunger Games music videos. Yes. I was obsessed with those. The gaming channel from Joey Graceffa. Um. And also Gen X Pen. If y'all remember Gen X Pen, she also had a gaming channel. And then Dan and Phil Games. Those were like the gamers that I would watch <laughs> when I was younger. Also, hi Liz and Aaron and May. Hello, welcome in. Jennifer Lawrence from The Hunger Games was your crush. We love Jennifer Lawrence in The Hunger Games. Oh my god. I was a PETA girl. Speaking of the Hunger Games, I was a PETA girl. I loved um, Josh Hutcherson. Trev, you're not the pin message, Freezy. <laughs> First crush was the Chad cow. Epiclip, hello, Benjamin, welcome in. 
Epic Lab, thank you so much for the 13 months. I appreciate it. Peta's the go. I yeah, I would die for Peta. I was a Peta girl. Me when it stopped. <laughs> <laughs> You're Team Peter from the start while reading the books, yeah. I... I think I was a Gale girl to start, okay? I was a Gale girl at the beginning, and then I, I think I switched to Peta towards the end of the Hunger Games, like the end of the verse book, and then into Catching Fire. But yes, Finnick, okay, Finnick was like my number one. Finnick, and then Pita. Man. Did any of you see the new Hunger Games movie? Um. And who likes Gail's block? Then the last time they like Gail. Okay, listen, Arthur, I changed. I'm a changed person. <laughs> okay, yeah, y'all saw the Hunger Games movie. I feel like we talked about this when it came out. Um. I actually really enjoyed it. Um, I read the book. I felt- I- I like forgot what happened in the book, honestly, but... What's-his-face did such a good job as... as Snow. I really liked him. Haven't seen anybody want to, though? Yeah, it's not bad. It was not bad. I enjoyed it. Um... Yeah, I'll get to it eventually. Man, you're a Gale girl in the beginning. Yeah, and then Finnick happened. Mm -hmm. Hi, Solar. Welcome in. Any plans to watch a Doom Part 2? I actually haven't even seen the first one. I really need to. Um, Sammy never watched Twilight. Always like Jacob because he had a strong... I have a werewolf face! Sammy! Oh my god. That's so funny. I was always an Edward girly. Team Edward, y'all. Robert Pattinson. That's my man. Did y'all know, actually, that Robert Pattinson is a big Final Fantasy VII fan? And he's, like, obsessed with Aerith. I just found this out, like, a few a few weeks ago. I was like, oh my god, Robert Pattinson! He's an Aerith, an Aerith guy. <laughs> he's such a little nerd, I know, I love him. Hi, Tiny, welcome in. Um, the Batman is a seven fan. Yeah. Suddenly, everyone attacks me for being a milky. Not a milky. Sammy can get away with pretending to be a werewolf. Oh my god. Thought he liked Tifa more. No, I think he's like. I think he's in love with Aerith. Here, let me look this up. Robert Pattinson. Aerith. Wait, what? Maybe it is Tifa. There are so- there are so many articles about this. Oh no. Nina, Nina, thank you for gifting us to Arthur. Arthur, enjoy. Read the first two Twilight books to fit, and everyone thought they were so boring. Edgy. Oh my god. Y'all, I remember. I remember when I was in middle school when Twilight came out. Um, I read the Twilight books. I read Eclipse in one day. I was obsessed. I read it in one day, and then I wanted to read Breaking Dawn. But there are, um, there are sex scenes in Breaking Dawn. And then my mother put- <laughs> My mother was like, You can read this, but I'm covering some of the pages. She like, she literally put black paper over the pages that I couldn't read. And I don't even remember if I finished it. I don't remember if I finished Breaking Dawn. I think it kind of bored me. Yeah, she covered the pages. The censorship. I mean, I was like, I think I was in seventh or eighth grade. Um, yeah, that was funny. I remember that vividly in my mind. 
Read Fifty Shades of Grey. Oh man, I don't know if I could ever read Fifty Shades of Grey. The birth gore is fine. Honestly, I don't. I don't remember if I read that either. Um, in seventh grade, me and my friend couldn't say the word sex. We <laughs> we just said Breaking Dawn, Katie. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh. Searching Zeke from Wizards of Waverly Place and finding out he used to have an OnlyFans. Oh my god. <laughs> Fifty Shades isn't that bad, just woefully written. Okay. Spends half the series talking about her inner goddess. <laughs> Fifty Shades written worse than 90% of smut fanfics. Okay, listen. Listen, I feel like that's a lot of... A lot of spicy books. Okay. I always see these TikToks on on book talk where people are like, "Oh my god, this book is so spicy." And then they like they show an excerpt from it and I'm like, "This reads like a Wattpad fanfic." I don't know. Um yeah, authors on AO3 need to be published. Exactly. Like I I have read some fanfics y'all and I'm like this needs to be published for everyone to read because it's so freaking good. Exactly, Trev. The spice is salt. Like, huh? Most of the spice books are written so trash, so... Yeah, the dialogue. I know, I'm like, huh? <laughs> I don't I don't know. Like, good for people for getting published and everything, but... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um... Only thing Fifty Shades brought out was a bunch of middle-aged women openly reading smart fun like Katie, real, real. Um, let me reading Maniclet. I have heard stuff about that. I, like everyone's talking about that, even though people don't even like people who don't even read Harry Potter are like reading Maniclet. I didn't know that it was getting traditionally published. That's really cool. Um. <laughs> it's Colleen Hoover, Chelsea. Oh my god. I have not read Colleen Hoover, and I probably will not read Colleen Hoover. Um, when is Shwake officially getting published? I don't know, Nina, but I need it to. I need it to. Like, y'all, these Shwake fanfics I've read. The Even the Mountains Crumble fanfic. That needs to be published. Um, what's another one? Lapel du Vide. Unfinished. That needs to be published though. Like, man. <laughs> the spicy smut. They don't even use real words. It's just like my woman. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Uh, remember coming across I published Slenderman sl Smut? Oh my god. 18th, you check out a Colleen Hoover book. And oh my god, yeah, I've never read one. I really, I really need to get back into reading, y'all. Like, I read fanfic sometimes. But it's been a while since I've read an actual, like, published book. <clears throat> Not mounts. Stop. Stop this. Lord. Most fire fanfics are some authors. Yeah, English is my first language. Or I'm sorry. To, yeah, I didn't update. I got ran over. I'm sorry I didn't update. My house burned down. And now I'm on. I'm living on the streets. But I got this fanfic chapter up for you guys. <laughs> it's like the best thing you've ever read. <laughs> like what? Oh, Lord. Anyway. <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't update. I was arrested, but I'm back. Lord. Um. <laughs> Red, what about John Cena and Dwight True? That is. That's wild. That's a wild pairing. Sorry I didn't update. I was in Chernobyl. Yep. Mm hmm. That's. That's all AO3. Uh, I am hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. I'll come in. Oh, 18th. That sounds horrible. I hate that. 
Yeah, I've heard I've heard things about her books that I probably will never want to experience. Hi Zach Bruce, welcome and thank you for grabbing your seat. Anyway <laughs> Should we Should we play Persona 3? Let's play Persona 3. I can't wait to read Persona 3 fanfic when um when I finish this game. <laughs> Yeah, enough with the fanfic talk. Okay, you know what annoys me though? I feel like a lot of times when people hear about other people reading fanfic, they're like, oh, they just assume that every fanfic you read is like smut or explicit. That's not true. Okay, y'all, there's such good fanfic that doesn't contain any of that stuff and it's so good. Yeah, this is art, literally. I'm telling y'all, these these fanfic authors, they need to be published. Hurt Comfort, you are so me musical because I'm always going on AO3 and I'm like, let me sort by kudos and let me make sure the Hurt Comfort tag is in there. <laughs> and I don't know what that says about me. <laughs> uh. Katie, oh yes, to recap, to recap, um, this conversation, Sammy's a werewolf, Trev is mil a milky, and Colleen Hoover has salty smut, yeah. <laughs> um, Nox, hello, welcome in. <laughs> Lord, if you like to feel the twang in your heart when you read angst. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Sorting by kudos. Mm -hmm. Every fanfic you read is smut. And you know what? That's okay. That's okay, Giselle. When you read fluff fanfics, kick, yeah, kick my little feetsies. Exactly. <laughs> I love reading my my shawake fluff and like screaming and crying. <laughs> okay, um, let me switch over here. Persona 3! We're here! Giselle, thank you so much for dropping that command. Yes, and thank you for pinning that message. Remember the content warning, everyone? Aki, go jump scare! Oh my god. Okay. Uh, I also need to turn off this music. Alright. And... Um, very excited to play today. Um, if you are not here, yeah, please look for spoilers if you need to, Freezy. Thank you so much for hanging out. If you're not here, uh, last stream, we made it to August. We made it to the August full moon. We finished it. And I don't think I progressed any further after that. Um, so I think today is probably going to be a lot of social links. Maybe we'll go to Tartarus. I'm not sure. Also, Lamb, no worries. Good luck with your meeting. <laughs> this werewolf gonna lurk for spoilers, Sammy. Thank you for lurking. <laughs> I hope you have a good day. Musical, you're in the last month. That's crazy. Oh my god. Also, Trev, thank you for lurking. <laughs> the cow emoji. Good luck with work, Trev. Aaron, you finished your playthrough last night? Oh my god, best person game you've ever played. We love to hear it. I gotta turn this up. I am. Thank you so much for the three stream watch streak. Also, thank you for the mod love. Y'all, I feel like we're also getting so many people in the party and it stresses me out. Like we got, we got Ken, who is currently at the dorm for the summer. Um... 
I think the dog is gonna be joining us. We just got Igus. It's crazy out here. It's crazy in seas. So Kimchi, thank you so much for the love. I am inconsolable about Kinamata. We're gonna feed him soup. Gonna finish P3 today. Nairu, enjoy. I hope you have the best time. Yeah, enjoyed it so much. You can always replay it. Do a little new game plus. Her Sony 3. <laughs> Manda, why did they give you an invoker? You're zero years old. <laughs> Oh, all right. Hello, big hero, baby girl. <laughs> okay, we have a Ken command now. We have so many commands for these characters. All right, let me add this. I already know what you want the command to be. This is so funny. There we go. We have Ken and Elfie. <laughs> <laughs> also, Nox, thank you so much for the 10 stream watch streak. I appreciate that. Amanda, thank you for adding that. All right, so we are on August 7th, y'all. It is Friday. We just finished the full moon yesterday. Um, is that a shell? A green turban shell from Yakushima. That's cute! Oh my gosh, we have a shell! So we're gonna put all our memories up here, maybe? Okay, um... I don't know what I'm gonna do. Alright, let me leave. Let's see if we can go talk to people downstairs. There's Fuka! People slept. I guess so. They took a nap. <laughs> Hi guys. Hey, so... <clears throat> so if the dark hour disappears, then our personas will disappear too. That's basically what those Strega guys are saying, right? Yeah. Oh, that's right. Okay, so we saw the Gwink, and we also saw the really dirty guy, but um, the coquette girl wasn't there. I don't know where she was. There are four shadows remaining. Let us do our best next time, too. However, the members of Strega also appear to be our enemies. Let us remain vigilant and continue taking shadows down. <sighs> Dude, our missions are always so exhausting. But last night was even worse because we ran into those Strega guys. And they look like a pretty annoying bunch. Man, I wish they'd just piss off. Everyone seems so exhausted. We don't have a whole group here anyway, so let's skip going to Tartarus tonight. Where the hell's Aki? Where's Aki go? Why is Ken just down here alone? Where's Aki? Maybe he's with his boyfriend. So, um... I saw something about TV- I saw something on TV about people with apathy syndrome. Apparently everyone was cured all at the same time. That's a little strange, isn't it? I mean, there's no way everyone can recover at the exact same time. So, how? Ken. I think it's because of us. Because Makoto and his crew are just like, so cool. <laughs> Jeb, thank you so much for lurking. I'll be back. Jeb, I appreciate it. <clears throat> Good luck with your errands. The staircase command. Hi, Miss Kalini. <laughs> Alright. <gasps> Hi, Aze. Let's for sure... Let's for sure hang out with Hi, Aze. Yeah, no one tell Ken. No one tell Ken that we're actually doing this stuff. Cobraman? What? Okay. Oh, <gasps> Cat! The cat looks carefree. 
What kind of cat do you think this is? A stray cat? Aw, you can tell, huh? It's a stray cat! But he's my friend. The first time I met him, he didn't even run away. He came up to my hand. So that means he's my soulmate, right? <laughs> sure. Sure. No, no. Yeah, oh, to be a little carefree cat in a Persona game. I would love that. Alright, we have a star Persona. Let's hang out with Hayase. Yes. Yeah. Ramen time. Hi, Chappy. Welcome in. Man, this is good. If I had the money, I'd get some for Mom. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention. I get to eat here for free. Why? Not just here, but every restaurant in the strip mall. They're all supporting me. Because you're such a star? I'm the only one who can eat as much as I want, wherever I want. But I feel kind of bad, <laughs> like I'm taking advantage of their kindness, so... The hell? Sometimes I pay the bill anyway. But someday, I'll pay them back for everything. But for now, I gotta take whatever I can get. That's why I have to make it big. It's for everyone who's been helping me. Oh. Sounds like a lot of pressure. Well, I'd be lying if I said it wasn't. A little pressure can be a great motivator. All that matters is how you deal with it. I feel like I recognize his voice actor. Did y'all already say who it was last time? By the way, who would you say is your biggest rival? If only a catchy Goro was in this game. I I feel like he wants me to say you. You, you're my biggest rival. You're pretty good. Fuck. You're a lot years away from my <laughs> Okay. Now. Okay. Maybe he's not wanting me to say that. <laughs> there isn't really anyone left who I want to compete with. The other guys on my team can't even keep up with me. You're just too good. What I'm looking for is a real challenge. Hey, you should think about taking track more seriously. Then we can really push each other. Might even reach new limits together. Okay. I feel like we're getting closer. He wants to reach new limits with Baby Girl. Oh my god. <laughs> also, Kimchi, hello. Welcome in. Don't care what people say about Hayase's eyes. Think he's cute? Wait, what do people say about his eyes? I think he's cute too. We'll catch each other between training sessions. Later. Yeah, struggling from success. <laughs> For sure. Hi, Zuchi. Welcome in. Oh, welcome back. Oh, hello. Is Haise gonna pay for baby girl's meal? I mean, I hope so. Okay, it's Friday evening. His voice actor is, uh, young, yeah. Oh, don't think he's in anything you recognize him from? Okay, gotcha. Oh, the new English ki Kiryu in Yakuza? Gotcha. Okay, so Yukari's here. They're all here. Where the hell's Aki? Aki, where are you? Mm. I don't know if I want to hang out with Mutatsu. Jack Frost doll? We already have that. We got like three of those. Um, I really need to raise my academics though. Okay, that raises courage and agility. Maybe we go eat a seafood platter? I think I might do that. Cause my, my academics are so bad. I'm like, I'm never gonna be able to hang out with um, Itsuru. You completed his social link the other day. That's amazing. I think I'm I'm pretty close to maxing a few social links. Let me actually check. Oh my god. Okay, we're at rank nine with the old couple. Um, we're at rank eight with Maya. 
Nine with Bebe. I think we'll for sure be able to max him today. Oh my god, we're at rank eight with Tanaka. <laughs> I feel like we could for sure max a few of these today. We'll see. Alright. Nate, thank you for grabbing your seat. Academics is very brutal. It makes me really upset. Come on, four? Yes! We're smart! Oh my god, we're smart, you guys! <laughs> oh. Is it. Is it Pharaoh's time? Hi, how are you doing? Hello. Hi, creepy child. I remembered a little more. The end won't be brought about by any one person in particular. It's going to happen because there are many who wish for it, almost as if it was decided from the beginning. Why? Oh god, I don't like that. Okay. But isn't it strange that there are those who would wish to bring about the end? I mean... Not really. I mean, people are depressed. People are depressed, y'all. Not really. Hmm, I see. Well, I guess if you're unhappy, you'd want it to be over quickly, huh? Otherwise, you might end up consumed by hatred for everything in this world. Well, enough of that for now. There was one more thing I wanted to tell you today. Soon, the flowers of poison will bloom. Guys, he makes me... he makes me really nervous. <laughs> okay. Three in the rival garden, and one in your own. What does that mean? Three in the rival garden. Who are our rivals? <laughs> I don't know if this has anything to do with the end, but you should be careful. <laughs> but I don't have a garden. <laughs> really? From where I'm standing, it seems like you're surrounded by colorful flowers. Why is that... Why is that kind of sweet? I feel like he's talking about my... My friends. And my social links. And then the three other ones are probably uh, the Gwink. And the Coquette girl. And then the nerd guy. Let's take a screenshot of that. Hi, Trouble from Astral. Yeah, by the way, your parents died, right? <laughs> I'll let you know if I find out anything else. That's what friends are for, right? Oh yeah, that's right, we're friends. Pharos gives me a carefree smile. Rank five. <sighs> well then, good night. You make me very uneasy, Pharos. Mmm. None of this shit makes sense. <laughs> Hello, this is Elizabeth speaking. Hello. I'm calling in regard to a recent change in Tartarus. Can we finally... go further? It seems that a path that had been blocked off is now open. I thought it prudent to inform you. Thanks. Well, then, I wish you a safe journey. Thanks. I really don't want to go to Tartarus. But <clears throat> I made a big mistake last time. Oh, hi. I made a big mistake last time in July. So I waited like three days before the full moon to go to Tartarus. I'm never doing that again. I'm sorry to disturb you, but do you have a moment? Uh, coming. Good morning. Hey, girl. There's actually something I need to tell everyone. But I think it would be best if you saw it for yourself. So I'd like for all of us to meet in the command room tonight. I'll see you then. Okay. <laughs> that's all that's all she's gonna say. Oh god, we're getting so many texts. Oh, we have more requests from Elizabeth. There's a sale at the pharmacy. Soul spinach sprouts. Mm. If you wanna go ahead, free to do whatever I'm chilling on my bed. I'm not in my bed, so mind your own 
Holy crap, I'm overwhelmed. Hi, Bo Watson, welcome in. I know, she's greeting us with a hair flip at 6 a.m. She's already put together. D yeah, didn't stress me out at all. Nope. Nope. Hi, Junpei. Lucia couldn't detect those people. Strega, I think? They must be very powerful to be, <clears throat> to be able to slip past her. Just who in the world are they? Let me think. I get the sense that there's quite a bit going on behind the scenes, but the idea is, the idea is simple enough. Their goal and ours have crossed. But the next time they get in our way, we'll take them down. That's all there is to it. Could it be? I didn't expect to meet Persona users outside of ourselves and those we've located and recruited. Not to mention ones filled with malice and hostility. As if we haven't been busy enough keeping the shadows at bay. Yeah... Um... <sighs> Maybe we go talk to... Maiko? But first I would like to go talk to Elizabeth. Aki wants violence? Yeah, Aki's like, come on. We gotta go fight them now. <laughs> and Thunder Gamer, thank you so much for Thunder Bits. I appreciate it. Max elderly couple first, because they're all heartwarming. Oh, remind me of parents. Max all social stats. Wow. October I stopped playing because it broke you. Uh oh. Our kids are off on their summer vacation. I'm exhausted from making them meals every day. Oh wait, we've already, um... We already read that. Yeah, thank you for saying that, Astral. Let's try not to foreshadow anything, like dates or months coming up. Um, but I do appreciate the bits. I like to take walks on the station. Sometimes I see a peculiar looking girl. Now, don't freak out, but listen to this. She's got a sword stuck through her head. I know those young girls like the piercings, but through the entire head? <laughs> you think it was some kind of trick? Well, if it was, it sure fooled me. You know, I thought that was just a... a headband. I don't know if it's actually a sword stuck through her head. <laughs> Marvelous! <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. Okay. Are you accepting a request? Holy crap, there are so many. Also, Liz and Amanda, thank you for the mod love. Appreciate it. Most excellent. Now, let's hear your report. Multi-target boost? Right. You must know. Have you heard the story about the straw millionaire? It is the story of a man who becomes wealthy after continuously bartering one item for another. I would like to see if such a feat is possible in reality. I've prepared this bandage wrap for you. Please use this bandage wrap as your bargaining chip and trade it for something satisfactory. By all means. Of course. I will await a rope you must know. Visit the shrine? Um... Okay. By all means, of course. <gasps> we gotta make King Frost. Okay. I await a report of success. All right. A shame. Dang, we can't ask Elizabeth out. That's okay. Very well. <clears throat> yes, the king. The king's returned. Maybe she loves physical comedy. <laughs> yeah. Walking with a sword through her head, I just... I don't know if it's actually... real. I think she would be dead, unless she's already dead. I don't know. My friend knows a lot about that revenge website. Like, a little too much, you know? It makes me wonder if he's been using this site to save revenge. He kept bringing it up, so I came out and said, Isn't that just a stupid rumor? Good for you, gamer student. Still here? 
Okay, we are gonna hang out with Maiko. Hi. Oh, hi. I was waiting for you. Is it okay if we talk? <laughs> okay. Y'all, last time I talked to Maiko, she was like getting prepared to run away from her home. Thank you. Thanks. So, um. Thank you for always helping me. But I gotta say bye for now. I go. Yep. I have to run away now. Remember not to tell mom and dad, okay? Bye bye. Girl, you can't go. Huh? <gasps> hey, you. Have you seen a little girl? She's in elementary school. Are these our parents? Will you just take a second and calm down? Calm down? What if something happens to her? Oh, this is for sure her parents. Oh, please. This is what happens when you force a child to study nonstop. Why are you always like this? Everything has to be my fault. Oh, that's because it is your fault. This never would have happened if you'd been watching her. Look, we don't Stop. have time for this. Stop arguing. I think I know who you are. You're the one, right? Maiko's told me about you. She said she played with a high school kid instead of practicing <laughs> piano. What? Oh, God. This is the first I'm hearing of this. <laughs> oh, my God. What the hell did you do to my daughter? <laughs> the mother's like, why? Why would you, like, let her say that and just be like, okay. The woman is extremely agitated. Shut up! Stop jumping to stupid conclusions. I'm sorry about this. We're Michael's parents. We haven't seen her since this morning. When we checked her room, we found a note that said, I'm running away. She's never done anything like this before. Whoa, it's probably your fault. Listen, what, what if I'm just straight up with them? It's probably your fault. Excuse me, you don't know anything. Mike, oh, why? Okay, they actually seem very distraught about this. Listen, if you have any idea where she is, I'm begging you to tell us. Uh, maybe the takoyaki stand? Takoyaki stand? Oh, that place. Right, let's try looking. Mm. Michael! Baby girl! Mom! Dad, and you too? Well, I... Uh, I... Michael, are you okay? Mm. You're not hurt anywhere? I'm okay. Oh, thank goodness. Oh. And she's probably just happy to let her parents actually show care for her. Parents are like... They're actually finding her. Why would you do such a thing? I was worried sick. Do you think that's funny, giving me a heart attack like that? Hey, that's enough. You made me worry too. I was so scared. You said you were getting a divorce mm -hmm. and, and I didn't know what to do. I... I don't want you to get divorced. <sighs> She's just a baby. <laughs> oh, so that's what this is all about. We're really sorry, Maiko. Why don't we go home and talk about it? It's awful we pulled you into this. I'm not sure what else to say. Hey, who told you to keep it a secret? Listen, listen. But, thank you. Yeah. Maiko. Maiko seems relieved to see that her parents care about her. 
Oh my god. And now she can finally talk to her parents about them getting a divorce. She can finally share her feelings. Ask why this is happening. Bye-bye. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh my god. Her little bye-bye. God. Makoto's just having a day, y'all. Also, Eddie, thank you for the seven months. Have we received a new mission? Oh, brother. Eddie, thank you for the seven months. Thank you for using your prime here. Also, Joko, welcome in. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Torquip, hi. I know the Via is so good. Hi, Boots, welcome in. Cutest bye bye ever, literally. I don't know, but the alarm's not ringing. <gasps> oh! <laughs> <That door>. <laughs> Look at the shirt! <laughs> it's a little shirt with wings! Are your wounds healed up? Huh? Where'd you get this collar? That collar is designed to help control his persona. Basically, it's an evoker for dogs. Why are we giving a dog an evoker? Wait, oh, does brother. Mara was going to fight with us? I honestly wasn't expecting this either, but the test results show it's quite possible. <laughs> He's just a dog, you guys. Why are we <laughs> Why are we having a dog join the team? In fact, it was actually a request from the chairman. We'll be looking after him here in the dorm. Kuro-chan, is this what you want? I guess translate for us. He says, I'm returning the favor. Oh my god, because we saved him? <sighs> Man, you're one loyal dog. Oh my god, I love him. Hey, sounds good to me. I, for one, welcome him with open arms. <laughs> the more the merrier, right? Here's a pure dog. Oh, good to have you, boy. He's so cute. All right, I'll take him for a walk. And it's the perfect time, because it's summer break. Yes, it is. You're free to enjoy your vacation, but don't forget about of your course. school. Of course, of course. Summer classes start next week, oh, so don't no. lose focus just because we have a lot of time off. The summer... Wait, what'd you say? Summer classes? Summer classes. Did you not uh, hear about uh, them? <laughs> I'm inconsolable. I feel like... I feel like I'm back in school, y'all. And I just got... I just got told myself that I'm going to summer classes. We're going to be taking supplemental courses. I've already applied for all of us. I know how difficult it's been to balance both school and our late night excursions. I'm sure you haven't had much time to study, so I apologize for that. Girl, I don't care. I don't care about studying. The chairman agreed it was a good idea as well. I could have sworn I told Takeba and Yamagishi. Are you serious? <laughs> First I've heard of it. You know what? At least we'll be able to rank up our academics, right? Um, sorry. I completely forgot to mention it. No way! <laughs> Junpei's gonna cry. Hey, you're the one with the worst grades here. Why are you so surprised? Come on! I wanna hear it. <laughs> I'm with Junpei Don't here. Yeah, totally. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, girlies. Well it's only for a few weeks, so let's do our best. <laughs> uh, at any rate, we've gained a new ally. Koromaru. He's a loyal companion who will fight valiantly for his master. Oh. Oh, God. So... Naka, hi. Um, so we could go to Tartarus, and we can see how how the dog uh he gets his persona. 
Hi Tanaka. Maybe we'll hang out with Tanaka. <laughs> Look at the dog. Hi. What? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Maybe I should take him for a walk tomorrow instead. We can walk with Coco Cola Maru. Oh, and you you like shake his little paw. This is incredible. 10 out of 10. Exactly. Hi Larry, welcome in. Game of the year. Oh, this is my best friend, actually. Koromaru is. Hi, I guess. Koromaru-san's persona exhibits a unique characteristic. It seems he has two types of powers that can be activated when using Theurgy. This is one of his biggest advantages. <laughs> what do you mean by that? Hello. Hi, Kuchi. Dogs can be very reliable, you know. Why, there are rescue dogs, seeing eye dogs, narcotic detection dogs. Let's put our trust in Karamaru. Okay. Um... By the way... What are we going to do about Korochan's meals? Are we gonna buy dog food or cook homemade meals for him? We should decide soon. I would love to cook homemade meals. Um... I bet Aki... Aki could boil some chicken for him. What? Summer school, huh? Well, it's not that I hate studying that much, but... I just don't think we should have to go to school during summer vacation, you know? So true. <laughs> His other biggest advantage yet is that he's a dog. Hi, <laughs> Mega Man, you're playing Persona 3 too. Let's go. <laughs> oh, man. Need a Koromaru remote? I feel like there has to be one on BTTV, right? Hey y'all. Let's hang out with Mr. Tanaka. Do I have a devil persona? No, oh, I'm gonna go get one. <laughs> Deserves every home cooked meal ever. I agree with that. But his other biggest advantage is that he's a good boy. Exactly. Welcome to the velvet room. Okay. Please, take a look. We need a double persona. We're at rank 8 with Tanaka, you guys. Hmm... Please, take a look. So Let's you'll be this. summoning this one? Very well, it's yours. Jesus Christ, it's so loud. Very well. We look... Tanaka Kinney gonna max the Tanaka social link first. You're calling me a Tanaka Kinney? I am not a Tanaka Kitty. <laughs> Hi Goose, welcome in. Happy Monday to you. We have no max ranks yet, but we're about to be at rank 9 with Tanaka. And I'm also at rank 9 with the grandparents and baby. So I think we'll be able to max them today. Mm -hmm. You sure come by a lot, baby girl. I must be doing something right then. But I suppose that means the value of a life lesson depends on the winner. I'm scared. The other day, a woman came to my office asking for a donation. Quite the looker, I might add. In fact, she was very much my type. <laughs> okay, thanks for letting me know, Tanaka. But no matter how attractive she was, I was repulsed by her dedication to charity work. <laughs> You're not gonna donate? Uh, I don't know if I say no, the tabloids are gonna tear me to shreds. Oh, on Tanaka. Stop. Stop. Why should I have to give my hard-earned money to a bunch of freeloaders? I pulled myself up out of squalor to get where I am today. I wanted to get back at the ones who used to laugh at me. This man has trauma. That's what I always dreamed of, anyway. But, to tell you the truth, now I have too much money. Profits are booming. I'm so busy, I don't have time to spend a yen of it. Tails, don't say that! 
No, no, let's not say that. I don't like that. I'm just gonna delete it. Um... Yeah, maybe you should spend money on therapy, Tanaka. <laughs> maybe I should train someone to take my place. We can spend your money for you, Tanaka. I could teach them my business philosophy and management techniques. It'd be a carbon copy of me. I I don't know. I don't know if we should be a carbon copy of Tanaka. It would probably cost me a fortune, but if it works, then it's easy living. <laughs> hmm. How would you feel about being adopted? <laughs> <laughs> Only joking. Okay. The people would get okay. funny ideas if I took in a child as old as you. Okay. Wow. President Tanaka looks sh looks selfish on the surface, but he seems to care about me deep down. Does he? I don't. I don't think he actually cares about Makoto, though. Makoto. <laughs> Know about that. <laughs> Only for the sake of the less fortunate, huh? Oh, Tanaka. I mean, maybe if he had someone like that when he was younger, he wouldn't have these feelings. Like this man. This man struggled growing up. Oh, it's Sunday. Hi, Chihiro. We haven't hung out with Chihiro in so long. I don't know what to do. Also, Arthur, thank you for the mod love. Appreciate it. <clears throat> yeah, Monkey might be my first Mac social link. Mm -hmm. Oh, brother. It's amazing! Good, good. It's a taupe soda. You get 10 of them. Not bad. 20 mad balls? Holy shit, we have to do that. Okay. Not hi dad. <laughs> hi dad. No, Makoto. Makoto, don't. <gasps> Summertime fun. We can oh my god, we can hang out with Junpei? Haize, Maya. So if you <gasps> Y'all thin young man! We gotta go to thin young man! Also, Jim Goose, thank you for coming to see. Where is he? Look at him just sitting there, he's finally here! Driving. You. <laughs> huh. Your eyes are so clear. Your soul must be burning brightly. <gasps> we have the academics we need. I can't say. The, oh my god, I like I didn't think about anything else. I don't even know if I have to do anything else today. But we're gonna hang out with him. The me that I see reflected in your eyes and the real me, if there is one, how far apart are they? About an arm's length? <laughs> oh, you mean literally? I guess you have a point. Oh, that's right. Your words are very beautiful. If I had someone to write with, I'd note them down. I have a fountain pen. It uses red ink. Blood red. My pen is my supporter, my spokesman, my friend. However, it seems to have disappeared. Without it, my screams are silenced. What are you talking about? Yeah, is he a poet? He seems like a poet. He talks very beautifully. The young man seems sad. Apparently his fountain pen's missing. <gasps> okay, so we have to go find his pen? Oh, brother, I'm gonna be... We have to check everything. <laughs> um, or we might have to buy something. Let me talk to him again. I can't say. 
Perhaps the creature <gasps> with white fur and bright eyes. Koromaru? Okay, let's go talk to Koromaru. I'm guessing he's in the dorm. Stripey Sunday! We have Stripey Sunday, we have um, Fuka Friday. Hey. I could pick it up if I ask Koromaru to move his paw. Arf? <laughs> Why is this so funny to me? Can you move your paw? We did it! Thank you! Thank you, sweet doggy! You're so cute. Okay, wait, let's talk to people here. <laughs> oh, good boy, Koro! He needs to speak, but can only arf. Also, hi, Lily, and a bad welcome in. I have heard that Koromaru-san's persona is Cerberus. This being appears in Greek mythology as the watchdog of the underworld. <laughs> He's our little watchdog. Considering how Koromaru-san was guarding the shrine alone for quite some time, it suits him perfectly. I agree. Let's see. It must be easier taking Koromaru on walks with the nights being cooler this time of year. Dogs can't regulate their body heat by sweating, you see, so remember to keep an eye on him. <laughs> I wonder if Koromaru-chan is enjoying dorm life. I really hope he'll get used to it and then come to love it one day. <laughs> I know the pet dog of Hades! Yeah. By the way... Oh right, this is Koromaru's new home, isn't it? It's gonna be a lot of fun with him around. I'm drinking his black coffee. Yo. Sports and schoolwork the same. No matter how strong you are, those who don't put effort in fail. It's the same with school. If you don't study, you won't pass your tests. Yeah, yeah. Where's Yukari? Hmm. Okay, we know Junpei's out. I'm so sorry, Junpei, but we're not gonna hang out with you. We have to go to the shrine. No coffee, only soup, exactly! Oh. oh! The pen in your possession! By any chance, is that my missing fountain pen? Thank you. Ah, welcome home, dear friend, and thank you for finding it. Now, the mighty scream quietly bellowing within me has regained its voice. My diary. We have a name! My name is Akinari... Kam Kamiki? Kamiki? Akinari. Another Aki! Have a seat if you'd like. I'll write something for the two of us. Yes, let's hang out. What is up with him? I swear he's sick. I know someone... I think Maiko is like... Talking about how he was sick, but then he was like, I'm not sick, Maiko. You're so easy to to convince or something. I remember you. You're the one who was playing with that elementary school girl. Why, why this sad music? She was very bright. Her face shone with the warm light of new life. And then there's me. Stop! Up in the Stop! <laughs> oh my god! The immediate piano, and then the way that he describes Maiko. That's so sweet. This is rank one. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I'm just a faint glimmer compared to her Stop. dazzling light. Misery is a harsh mistress. I feel as though I'm lying in an unyielding darkness. Do you understand how I feel? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. I mean, Makoto lost his parents and he like has no one. I might. Liar. Oh my god, I'm sorry! If you're not lying, then you're just ignorant. <laughs> I'm sorry. He got so mad. Fuck. Any day now, I'm going to die. I have an incurable hereditary disease. Oh. 
Unless you're in my situation. Yeah. You can't understand how I feel. But I prefer it that way. I wouldn't wish this on anyone. There are no platitudes to stave off death. Sorry about that. Shit. I didn't mean to depress you or anything. I want to redo this. I want to redo this. I don't <laughs> feel bad for choosing the wrong option. It's been quite a while since I spoke to someone my own age. Is he really our age? It's only natural for those dwelling in the depths of darkness to yearn for the light. I'm glad we could meet, though. If there is a god, I'll be able to thank him soon enough. I've become acquainted with Akinari Kamiki. Holy shit. The sun? Stop. I is he the sun persona? Thou, thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Oh, brother. Oh, brother. Thou shalt have okay. a blessing when thou choosest to create the persona of the sun. Archon. Of course he's the sun. Dying young man. Dying young man. <laughs> okay. However, I doubt we will ever meet again. Shut up. No, we will. This was just a chance encounter. Nothing more. Goodbye. No, we're gonna keep on visiting you, okay? I parted ways with Kamiki and then headed back to the dorm. Holy fuck. Well, that was a oh, time. <laughs> we love Persona. <laughs> Hi, Coochie. I just came by to check in on Koromaru. Do you think he'll do well? He'll be fine. That's good to hear. Well, given his reputation for loyalty, I wasn't too worried in the first place. If you have any concerns, please feel free to let me know anytime. It's only fair, considering I was the one who requested that Koromaru join the squad. Ikuchi, you're crazy. Oh, I'm all for Koromaru joining us. He's totally welcome. I'll even throw in training lessons from the master. <laughs> um, I'm pretty sure Korachan's already more disciplined than you. Could you even sit still if someone told you to stay? Hey, don't compare me to a dog. <laughs> I'm totally disciplined. I can follow directions. Kinda. Kinda. Yeah, you really sold us on it. Anyway, so, Mr. Chairman, uh, about those summer classes. Ah, yes, I heard about Kirijo-kun's plan. It sounded like a good idea, so I went along with it. No, why would you agree to that? No, literally. I don't want to do some oh, classes. Was I being nosy? Oh, I'm missing out on my passionate summer romance. Junpei, who are you romancing? Who are you romancing? Farewell. <laughs> Beautiful city girl. Awaiting me. By the shoreline. I love how he has this whole this whole like idea in his head. It's out of a movie. The city or the shores. <laughs> Pick one. Even if you didn't have classes, you'd probably just bum around the station all day. You should just accept your fate. Oh, by the way, Mr. Chairman, weren't you about to tell us something before he arrived? Oh? Hmm? Ah, that's right. Aside from my unnecessary meddling, <laughs> I do have another request for all of you. His voice acting there. Does everyone have a moment? Everyone? Okay, yeah. Yeah, his life is a movie. No, Zeno is so good. I love I love his voice so much. Hey. I think it's a good time for you all to get a routine health checkup. You know where Tatsumi Memorial Hospital is, right? Oh, that's where Sonata Senpai was treated okay. before. Okay. With how much you've all been fighting lately, it'd be best to stay on top of your physical health. Yeah. It wouldn't be good if your personas were causing any strain on your bodies, right? I mean, that's nice of him. That's nice to be like, you guys should go to the doctor, you know, stay healthy, but also, I just, 
Again, Akuchi, I don't know how to feel about him. I expect it shouldn't be too much of a detour to stop by the hospital after your summer classes. I understand. Still, this is rather sudden. Mm -hmm. Don't worry too much about it. Like they say, a stitch in time saves nine. Or your side. Who says that? <laughs> I've never heard we'll that be before. We'll doing the checkups individually, one day at a time. You can decide amongst <laughs> yourselves who goes when. <laughs> Don't forget to deck up for your checkup. <laughs> uh, just kidding. <laughs> oh, maybe bring your evokers in case you need to take any shots. Don't say that. <laughs> Don't say that. What's wrong with him? Yes. Oh my god. He said, maybe you should bring your gun, you know? Lord. I was just talking with everyone about Koromaru. We need to be taking on walks, but we won't be assigning that duty to anyone in particular. It would help if you could take Koromaru out for a walk at night if he seems he wants to go out for one. Okay. Well, where is he? I don't want to go to Tartarus today. You see, guys, he's weird. Man, you want to kick him down the stairs, Akuchi? <laughs> also, by the way, Abaddon, thank you so much for the ten stream watch streak earlier. I think I missed that. And uh, Burizu, hello, welcome in. Thank you for grabbing your seat. I don't want to hear that your grades are slipping because you're spending too much time in Tartarus. There's nothing I can do to help that. So study hard and do your best in summer school. Um, I see an ad just came on, and I was actually gonna go on a break, so while this ad plays, I'm gonna go to the bathroom really quick. Alright, thank you guys for hanging out. Torkip, thank you for being here. Yes, please avoid spoilers. Elysius, hello, thank you for grabbing your seat. Yeah, I appreciate y'all. Um, when I'm gone, you can check your yeehaws. Ooh, that's a new yeehaw. Check your bent checks. 48%? Not horrible, but not good. But thank you guys, give me like two minutes and then I'll get back and we'll figure out what we're gonna do for the evening. All right, one sec. is done. <laughs> the Junpei commands. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, um, let's continue with some persona. Um, 
Oh, I need to turn this down a little bit. Okay. Utatsu. I really don't want to go to Tartarus, you guys. I should probably check the calendar. Let's see what we have coming up. Okay, so we have summer school this whole week. And our physical exam is on Friday. Oh, there's a summer festival. A summer festival on Sunday? Okay. Welcoming ceremony. For school, maybe? Okay, and then Saturday. It's a full moon. All right, maybe we'll go to Tartarus after summer school. Let's do that. Oh, we can hang out with Koromaru. Maybe we should do that, actually. Where is Koromaru? Maybe outside? Let's see. No. There's I guess. What a cute little doggy! Um, let's see. I get no longing to attend summer school, but I think it's necessary. After we defeat the rest of the shadows, we'll become ordinary high school students again. And if we fall behind in our studies now, we'll be in big trouble later. <laughs> That's it. Junpei the Wise has yet another brilliant idea. All I have to do is become a dog, and I won't have to go to summer school either. <laughs> Kormar's like. You can't yes? become a dog. You can't be like me. Hmm? Koro-chan is trying to say something. I bet he's complimenting me for being so smart. Are you stupid or something? I bet he's laughing at you, saying how stupid you are, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Summer school starts tomorrow. Honestly, the more I think about it, the more I'm dreading it. Yeah, seriously. Damn right. Hey, Koro, want to switch places with me? Yes, let's go for a walk. Oh, hey, what's up? Whoa! Is that your dog? Whoa! <laughs> Hi, Kenji. I was like, who the fuck are you? Look at his outfit. He's got the yellow, the yellow jacket on. He's got camel pants. Wow, he looks like a smart one, unlike his owner. But what the fuck do you mean? <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> so, how's life, man? Oh my god! Why is he like this? <laughs> no, literally Jesse Pinkman ass bit. Real. He's just joshing. He's just joshing us. How's life? Um, I don't know. We haven't really talked to you in like a few months. Sorry. Where'd and the I dog go? The girl in that show has this mature vibe. You know what I mean? <laughs> I love this dog. Whoa, looks like this guy's had his fair share of fun. Guess we should start heading home then. See you at school. <laughs> Kenji! Kenji makes me laugh. He makes me giggle a lot. Man. Summer school starts today. Yay! Good morning. Ooh, it's already so hot at this hour. By the way, have you heard anything about the dates for the health checkup? I haven't. I mean, I checked the calendar, but. Jeez. What, really? I told Junpei to let you know. Yours is on August 14th, baby Goku. Anyway, it's seriously way too hot out here. Just hurry and get inside. I need to be in a, con in a classroom with air conditioning stacked. Do you all have air conditioning in your schools? Because we did not. And it was horrendous during the summer. Or I guess like, end of fall. Or beginning of fall. Beginning of the school year. Yeah, Angie, you didn't. It was so bad. <laughs> First day of summer school, yay! Oh, we get academics for this? Nice. Hi, Deepaw. Good morning. How are you? It's 
school and he had heat. Yeah, we had heat. That's it. Live in England, so no. Mm. Only had one. Only one room had it. It was the IT room. I feel like that makes sense because like all the equipment could make it really hot in there. Mm, gotcha, Tiny. Maybe have one hot week a year. I gotcha. We had some teachers that would bring in a like window AC unit and that would help. But still. Depot, it's your birthday! Oh my god, happy birthday! Getting ready to eat pancakes! Have some delicious pancakes and I hope work goes well today. Oh my god. All the happy birthdays for Depot and chat. Think in your school, yeah, only some rooms had it. Okay, second day of summer school. Let's get on with today's lesson. I know it's hot, everyone, but let's just try and get through class. Focus, focus. Still, who would have thought that people would actually attend this course over the summer? You, lo you sure are a curious lot. Oh, today's subject is tarot. Despite originating in 15th century Europe as normal playing cards, tarot cards evolved into tools of divination. There are a variety of tarot card decks, including the Mar Marcel and the Rider decks, but today, in honor of the great Crowley, we'll be using the Toth deck. So, continuing on. 22 Major Arcana and 56 Minor Arcana. Minor arcana are also sometimes called pip cards. The major arcana feature a variety of illustrations on their faces, beginning with the fool and ending with the universe. They tell a story in numerical order that represents an individual's journey through life. Each major arcana represents a stage on that journey. And each stage represents an event an individual must experience to achieve wholeness. Let's do just that. <sighs> whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Yeah, are we taking notes here? I'm gonna get your notebooks out. The first card numbered zero is the Fool. It represents beginnings and suggests infinite possibilities. In other words, the beginning of life. I mean, Makoto's the Fool, right? Also, Tiny, thank you so much for the 100 bits. Gonna play P3 with your nephew, have so much fun. I really appreciate that. Have a good rest of your day. The next card, the Magician, represents action and initiative, but also immaturity. High Priestess represents contemplation and inner knowledge. The Empress represents both motherhood and maternal love, as well as one's vitality. The Emperor is an opposing card. It represents fatherhood, as well as leadership and decision-making skills. The Hierophant represents formality and knowledge. It's a symbol for religion. That is to say... Wow. He's really gonna go through all of them. So this is... This is actually interesting this time. Oh my god. <laughs> that was my bit alert. <laughs> the lovers represent choice. Here, the individual finally begins to develop a conscience. The chariot represents the individual's victory, but only a momentary one. Justice is, is exactly what it sounds like, knowing what is right and what is wrong. The hermit represents self-reflection. In other words, searching for answers deep within one's heart. Fortune represents fate and the opportunity it brings. Strength represents both passion and self-control. It's depicted as power with reason. The hanging man reflects the individual's inability to take action. Spiritual death awaits the individual with the 13th card, which is aptly named death. Death is considered a transitional card. With death, the old ends and the new begins. All right. Whoa, okay, we're halfway through. Temperance is the balancing of opposites. Opening one's eyes to the world allows for growth. And then an encounter with the devil is where one faces temptation. At the tower, the individual's values will start to collapse. It seems as if there's nothing to believe in. The individual then finds a glimmer of hope in the star, granting one peace and serenity. In turn, this makes one vulnerable to the moon's illusions, which gives way to fear and trepidation. But the individual may be rewarded with a bright future by the sun, which signifies true achievement. Judgment awaits the individual at the journey's end when looking back on the path one has traveled. The final card is the universe, which represents the individual reaching full awareness. This is so interesting. I had never actually known that the tarot cards were meant to be like... 
they, they're originally like red in that order. Is this real? Like, is this real for tarot cards in real life too? Hi, Ferris. We all welcome in. It is real. Wow. Wasn't it the world the last one? Um, I think in Persona 5 and Persona 4, we would get the world card. But here they call it the universe. And that's the growth of an individual as explained by the tarot cards. Perhaps all this talk about life doesn't hit home with you young folk just yet. Hmm. <laughs> well, then. well, now you can use all 78 cards to divine the future in detail. But most people only use a 22 Major Arcana. Next, let's talk about the fortune telling using in Major Arcana. First, you need to shuffle the cards. Shuffle time! If a card is reversed, its meaning will change. Now this is important, so pay attention. Man. We are academics for that. Another lecture. Yeah, every character represents that in game two. Yeah. Oh, do we only get one for that? Oh no, we got two. Okay. Took you till the end of the game to get academics to max. I'm worried that that's what's gonna happen with me. Academics is so hard to raise up. Oh. <gasps> oh, that's right. We have our checkup today. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. I don't like the doctor. I uh, guess we'll get started. More Edugawa, Jesus Christ. Yad hey vav hey. How are you all handling the heat? I could brew you some of my special tea if you'd like. <laughs> now let's continue with our special summer course, The Truth Behind Magic. I'm talking about Kabbalah. I assume all of you have at least heard of Kabbalah, yes? It is known in the mystical study of the Hebrew scriptures, but... As I mentioned before, it had a great impact on Western sorcery. Okay then. Hmm. Can he take a vacation? I don't think so. I mean, I think he really likes to teach. Who was the person who formed this incredible ideology known as Kabbalah? According to legend, it was Moses. Yes, that Moses. The Moses who gave us the Ten Commandments and split the Red Sea. But in reality, it was formulated by a group of rabbis long, long ago. However, because it features such a complicated coded system, Kabbalah did not become known to the Western world until much later. Now, it is important to note that there are many different ancient methods of deciphering Kabbalah. For example, there is gematria, the interpretation of text by replacing letters with the numbers they represent. There is notarikon, where you take a letter from each word to form another sentence or thought. And there is also Tamura, a method by a method where letters of words are replaced, thereby giving the sentence a new meaning. All these different methods make it difficult to fully comprehend Kabbalah. So continuing on. One of the most important ideas, ideas of Kabbalah is the tree of life comprised of the ten Sephirot. Sephirot? Most illustrations depict it as a chart shaped like a tree. The 10 nodes represented by the Sephirot and the 22 paths connecting them all come together to form a map of God's creation and the spiritual ascent of man. 22 nodes and there are also 22 tarot cards. Where did these come from? Or where did we come from? Where are we going? These answers lie in the Sephirot. In training your magic, it's important to picture the Sephirot every so often. And when you are meditating, you should focus on the Sephirot as well. Is this gonna be on the test? Okay. <laughs> Did you all notice that I said there were 22 paths? <laughs> <laughs> the laughing! 
<laughs> Same number as the Major Arcana I spoke of before. Now continuing on, according to Kabbalah, existence is broken up into four worlds. Before I forget, I'll be giving supplementary lessons at the nurse's office as of the second semester. I'm thinking of doing demonstrations with tarot cards. As such. But I won't have time for that during the lecture, so if you're interested, stop by after school. Everyone is welcome. <laughs> <laughs> This guy's funny. Hi Basil, come in. How are you? I also just love that, um... This drunkard's voice actor. <laughs> okay, it's hospital time. I'm scared. Thanks for being so patient. That just about concludes your checkup. Why are we in a dark hospital room? Why is it dark? Why aren't the lights on? Sorry yours ended up taking so much longer than everyone else's. Why? Um, it's about time. I'm sorry. Really. If I'd known how long it would take, I would have scheduled an entire day for Jesus. it. Jesus! It took the whole night? Your persona abilities are rather unusual compared to the others, aren't they? That's why we had to run so many more tests on you. Is that really the only reason? No, I'm scared. Well, based on how you've performed so far, I don't expect there to be any problems. Persona abilities can be dangerous, depending on how they're used. With that in mind, it can't hurt to err on the side of caution. How are you feeling about it? Do you have any concerns about your power? I mean, I wasn't until you said something about it. I don't want to make it. I don't want to make him seem like I'm I'm concerned. No. No, we're going to say no. Good to hear. Okay. Oh, he's clapping for us. Thanks. And I don't think there will be any issues with your test results either. I truly am grateful for everything the team has done, especially you. Things have really changed for the better since you arrived. Our team has grown, and we've even figured out how we can eliminate the dark hour. In a way, You've sort of gotten the clock ticking for us again. It's almost as if we were just waiting for you these past 10 years. <laughs> I'm afraid I can only support you from behind the scenes. But I'll be counting on you to eliminate the four remaining shadows. Okay. Now then, it's getting pretty late. Why don't we get you back to the door? Oh. Oops, excuse me for a second. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Guys, I'm stressed out. I'm like, I'm really stressed out. Hi, Cupid, welcome in. Also, Azumi, welcome in. Oh, thanks for your help the other day. Uh-huh. Yes. It's missing from that document? It's urgent? Wait, but, but by today? Who are you talking to? Looks like you received an urgent call. I should head back to the dorm alone. Who are you talking to, my guy? Iwatodai. Iwatodai. This is the final train bound for Tatsumi Port Island. Please board before the scheduled departure time. Oh, brother. Oh, it looks like you're at Iwatodai Station now. Why are... It's so late. You are starting to get worried. Um, did you run into any trouble? My checkup took a while. Oh, I see. I hope everything's alright. I'll let Kirijo-senpai know. We're in the command room right now. I'll go ahead and navigate you back to the dorm. I'm sure you'll be fine, but considering what happened with Koro-chan, I'd rather play it safe. Okay. I'm so stressed out, you guys! Also, just don't thank you so much for the mod love. Uh, <laughs> why do I feel like I just can't trust anyone right now? Thanks. <sighs> like, 
What's going on with Fuka? This is weird. Wait, I can sense a shadow, and it's really close to you. It's over at the Moonlight Bridge. I have to fight it alone. It's too dangerous to go alone. You should stay put until everyone else gets there. Oh no, there's another reading near the shadow. It's a person. I'll buy some time. What have we here? <laughs> it's the quink. Hello. What a what a shadow that is. <laughs> so much power, so much chaos. I'd not be foolish enough to turn my back on such a predator. And on top of that, we have an unexpected guest tonight. Not a very favorable situation, all things considered. So, given this little predicament, how do you intend to partake? I don't know. Are, are we gonna fight with you, Takaya, or what's going on? Let's see what you got. Come on, I wanna see you. So long as you summon your persona. Me, I will allow it. I don't know what our foe is capable of, but I trust you can protect yourself. Y'all, oh, this is crazy. Also, QB, thank you for the mod What a hapless night, is it not? Well then, shall we begin? Why is he got a slaying? <laughs> you have to see who the quink was, Nina! This is the quink! The gun twink! <laughs> Uh-oh. Great. Shadow of the Abyss. I'll go with Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, okay. Oh god, I feel like a cloud. Hmm, so that's your strategy. This too is fate. He, he uses the gun. What's next? Okay. Um... That makes he has to have a persona. It's tougher than it looks. You make a good target. Holy shit. Okay. What to do? Never mind. No, 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 no. I'll go with. Fuck. That was quite the spectacle. But it's time to end this. This too is fate. As a reward for your efforts, let me show you my power. Come! Persona! How about this? What the hell is that? Megadola? He was surprisingly unsatisfied, wasn't he? How oh, is he so powerful? <laughs> oh no! Oh no! The defeated shadow seems to have dropped something. Is that an evoker? Hmm. Your persona ability. Hey, is what truly was that? Fascinating. The fuck? It's different from the one I saw the last time, isn't it? So. You can choose from multiple personas to fit the situation. You must be burdened with an extremely unusual fate. Wait. It seems your friend has arrived. Okay, so he obviously summoned his persona without an evoker. The yellow eyes are throwing me off now. Then I suppose I'll have to be on my way for tonight. 
You're just gonna leave? What is your name? I don't know if I want to tell you that. <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything. Smart. Discretion is the better part of valor. Enemies though we may be, I'm not one for leaving a debt unsettled. I shall have to repay you another time. Okay. Hey girl. That was weird. Are you alright? Did you already defeat the Shadow? Good work, but that was an unnecessary risk you took. I had help. You can fill me in on the way back. In any case, I'm glad you're okay. I explained what happened on our way back to the dorm. That was so weird. Yeah, his piss eyes, his yellow eyes. They're freaking me yes. out. Also, Caleb, hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Um, you had a long night, huh? On that note, let's not go to Tartarus tonight. Yeah, I don't want to go. I'm sorry. Thanks. I'd like to look into Strega with the chairman's help. If I find out anything, I'll let you know. Also, I understand your circumstances last night, but try to avoid staying out late from now on. That was not my fault. That was Ikuchi's fault. Okay. I feel like I'm losing my mind. I don't know if I'm being, like, too harsh on Akuchi, But I just don't know to f how to feel about him. I feel like he knows something that we're he's not telling us. Also... Also... Um... When... When Akutsuki was like... You know, it's kind of like we've been waiting 10 years for you to show up. I'm like, was that supposed to... Is, is that supposed to set off alarm bells in my head? Like, is this fate? Was Makoto led here? Specifically by someone? <laughs> like, I feel like I'm losing it, you guys! Okay. <laughs> um... Okay, more, more academics, that's good. It's the laid back hair. It's, it's the jokes that he makes. There's a box on the counter. Thank you, I got my SP stuff, good. <sighs> uh, at least summer school's over now, but doesn't it feel like we kinda waste our summer vacation? I'll have to make a bunch of plans to make up for it. I wonder if anything's going on I soon. Suggestion. I am currently aware of a summer festival tomorrow and a film festival the following oh. day. Oh, that's right. Wait, I guess, are you thinking about going to the festivals? Yes. Indeed. My data indicates that festivals and other like events offer unique experiences. So, for investigative purposes, I plan to infiltrate such a shindig. Yeah. <laughs> well, try not to stand out too much. Oh no! Oh my god, guys! I think we're gonna max out Tanaka! He's gonna be our first max. Hi, listen though, thank you for grabbing your seat. How are you? Um, one sec. I need to close my window quick. Not my window, my curtains. Let me just do this. Sun, the sun was shining in my eye. Tanak was your first max too, Doog. Yeah, I hear a lot of a lot of y'all say Tanak is your first. And <laughs> you come around listen. I I like to hate on Tanaka. It's very fun. It looks like Kurijo Senpai and not and Sonata Senpai went out again. How do they still have energy after summer school? Where are they going? Kari's gonna go to bed early. Um. 
man. Hi, Lynx. Lynx, welcome in. How are you? Where's Koromaru? Okay. Yeah, nothing else to do at night other than talk to Tanaka. The old couple you're here first rank? We're very close to maxing them too. Jihiro is yours? Oh my god, I'm doing so bad with Jihiro. I'm at rank four with her. It's very sad. Alright guys. Tanaka rank ten time. I do have something of a life lesson in mind, though it might not necessarily apply to you. Still interested? Then let's not tarry any longer. The clock's ticking. Pay attention now. I've decided to make a donation. Whoa! They're raising money to help uh, orphans in foreign countries. Tanaka! Oh my god! I don't get the wrong idea. Oh. I'm not doing this out of the goodness <laughs> of my heart. It's a long-term investment. Okay, okay. Children who learn to cope with adversity are more likely to become rich and famous. Like me. <laughs> I'm thinking of donating 10 million yen. 10 million uh, not yen? Not a corporate donation, but a private one. But when I told them over the phone, they sent me this. Present Naka handed me a piece of paper. It looks like a thank you letter from the charity group. I received it the very next day. Guess I can't back out now. Wow. 10 million yen is nothing to me, though. Okay. Once those children grow up and become successful, I'll introduce myself to them. I'll say, I'm the one who made all this possible. Then I'll be well taken care of in my old age. If it wasn't for our that, conversations, but... I probably wouldn't have considered this. By talking to you, I seem to have developed an interest in watching others mature. I thank you for that. Actually, mm, I should be thanking myself for so wisely taking note of this. Beneath his selfish demeanor, I can tell he really appreciates me. I feel like I fully understand me now. I feel like I fully understand him now. Um, I so I I don't know if he appreciates us. I am thou. Thou art I. The bomb thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The... the hymnal music? The innermost power of the devil upon hath been set free. Are we going to church right now? We now bestow upon thee. The ultimate form of the devil within thyself. Wow! Rank 10, y'all! And we got a trophy! You can now fuse Bales Bales Bub. The Lord of Hell. Let's go. You can keep that letter. Oh, okay. Uh, 10 million yen. I worked myself to the bone for that money. And all I have to show for it is that piece of paper. But it's not a bad feeling. Wow. I'll be going now. The paparazzi could be anywhere. Are people really taking paparazzi pictures of you, Tanaka? If any one of them were to find out, my brilliant plan would be ruined. Oh, by the way, about that exclusive modeling contract, I've decided to pass on that deal. Rather, it's your fault for sending me mixed messages. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's Makoto's fault. Anyway. Quit associating with shady middle-aged men like me, and find what truly makes you happy. Okay, at least he says this. Bye forever. <laughs> Goodbye forever! <laughs> oh my god. Please. <laughs> Y'all, I'm so sorry. The way I... The way in my free company in Final Fantasy XIV, whenever I say goodnight or goodbye, I always say goodbye forever. <laughs> and then he says that. 
<laughs> yeah, we rid of him now, but we're gonna see him on TV. He's gonna be going up on the TV screens and we're gonna buy from him. Am I really a Tanaka Kinney? I think I might. I might be. Oots and Mana on the same page. <laughs> we're all Tanaka Kinneys. Lord. Summer vacation continues. That's right, there's a summer festival going on that shrine today. Who's messaging me? Summer festival! Oh my god, she sent a heart. Oh. So I have to choose? I have to choose who to go with? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I feel like we have to go with Mitsuru and with Igus. We're gonna do that. Mitsuru and I guess. Let's go. I know the forced decision, man. We could have gone alone. <gasps> it looks rather busy. I guess be sure not to stray too far from us. This is so cute. Look at her horse hooves. even registering to you. Not should we hold hands? <laughs> Wait, she's gonna get so mad. She's gonna get so mad at me for saying this. Should we hold hands? Oh wait, wait. Oh, I'm saying that to Igus. So you wish to restrain me? Oh, <laughs> oh, frick. No, no. You warned that my ability to jettison my hand from my wrist would make holding it a poor method of restraint. Fine, fine. Just make sure to stay close to us. Mm? This aroma. Food. Takoyaki. This is takoyaki. Would you like to try some? Can she eat? Shopkeep. I would like to purchase one. Shopkeep? Um, got it. Coming right up. Shopkeep. <laughs> it's but Sue does not know how to talk to people. <laughs> well, aren't you a lucky guy with two beautiful ladies? I'll throw in an extra for you. On the house. Oh. On the house? Do the takoyaki have some kind of architectural purpose? <laughs> She's so funny. Mm. Oh, extremely high temperature <laughs> juices have spurted out from inside. Why would I'm you glad you enjoy it like that. Looks as though you've had another valuable experience. You should have some too. Show I guess the true nature of takoyaki. As for me, I'll have to decline. Why? Why? What are those? Those are masks. They're worn over the face as a form of recreation. She needs to put one on. I see Featherman masks. Oh my gosh. <laughs> True nature is burning yourself to death with those. Yeah, with the takoyaki. Inside the takoyaki. There's Featherman masks. I see... I mean, there's the uh, Fox masks. I'm trying to see if I recognize anything else. No. One can find enjoyment by hiding one's face? Hiding your face isn't the objective, exactly. Rather, you get to experience having a different one. <sighs> Putting this into words is proving difficult. So then, by wearing a different face, you are able to become a different version of yourself? Yes, that's about right. Your degree of comprehension is actually quite stunning. At this rate, a few more tests and the chairman may give you permission to go out on your own. Oh, I didn't know she was, like, confined. Oh. Max! Max, thank you for the 20- er, No, 36 months! Holy crap! Three years! Max, thank you so much. That's so kind. I really, really appreciate it. I hope you're- I hope you're doing well today. How are you? 
forward to that. Hey there, ladies! Wanna try your hand in a lucky draw? Make some nice memories? What do you say? Odds are looking good. Lots of winning tickets left. Hmm. Why don't we give it a try? Go, I guess. Oh, Makoto's gonna go. The box is filled with triangular lottery tickets. Let's dig down to the bottom. Congratulations, you won! Wow. You must have incredible luck to win on your first try. What did we win? Here is your prize. Enjoy. A Jack Frost doll? We have three of these already. <laughs> I have won a water pistol. Oh, no. Between this and my onboard firearms, which is more effective in combat against the shadows? Here, <laughs> let's trade. In exchange, I'll give you these marbles I won. <laughs> She's like, They're take beautiful. the marbles. Don't you agree? Well, I think we've seen all the vendors now. It's starting to get late, so let's head back. Not yet. The mystery of the shooting game is yet unsolved. I precisely struck the item to unbalance its center of gravity, yet it did not even budge. Is it rigged? <laughs> Perhaps you should ask Iori the trick behind it when we return. Come on, let's go. That's so silly. My gosh. I kind of love them. I love her. Max, I'm glad you're doing well. Yeah, I see you're working. Good luck with work today. Thank you for lurking. Thank you for the resub again. Also, Birdie, hello. Thank you for grabbing your seat. <laughs> Different from the FES cutscene. I'll have to go back and watch it. And Today, we're sprucing things up with a summer-only Amazing Commodities Monday special. So dance, if you wanna go ahead, What's happening? I'm going to do it. <gasps> Spooky season set. Good, good. Purse paper. Not bad. And vanish ball. Well, I guess I'll buy them. Sure. Gotta give Thanks, Tanaka more kid. money so we can keep donating to charities. Oh, there's more. Bye -bye. Oh, next Sunday. Okay. Kenji. Kenji, Kenji, Kenji. Man. Hi, Data. Welcome in. First Persona game I fear I'm addicted. I'm so glad that you're enjoying it. Oh my gosh. Do you think you'll play um, Persona 5 or 4 next? Hey, let me go over here. So we could see a movie with Kenji. <laughs> oh, okay. Calm woman is never gonna leave this shy man. Oh my god, shy man, you should go to the beach. I want to go inside the cafe. What the hell? I don't think I'm ever going to be able to. Okay, I actually want to buy some of these um, soul, spinach, soul spinach sprouts. Uh, let's buy two. We can plant those after our vegetables are done. I'm going to check over here. <gasps> Who are you? Damn it, that stings pretty bad. Just my friggin' luck, huh? Hell you want. Can you see I'm not really in the mood for talking right now? Bandages? Okay. Feeling like I owe a punk like you doesn't sit right with me. You're a student, right? Guessing Gecko Con if you're from around here. Here. I'm not thanking you or nothing, but you can take this. Student handbook. I'm guessing this is for Elizabeth? So I guess go over there 
spinach one of the best veggies? I do enjoy some spinach. Hmm. I think my favorite veggies are probably asparagus, though. I love asparagus. He wakes up in the afternoon, leaves at night, and usually doesn't come back until sunrise. Where do they go that late at night? That is escapade club? The security is too lax at those kinds of places. I heard they don't even care if a high school student just walks in wearing their uniform. That's true. Hi Weezy, welcome in. Broccoli is good too. Marvelous. I'm looking forward to it. Remember when we were younger? Are you a request? And Let's hear the results. And it was like so common to hate on broccoli, but like, why is that? Because broccoli is so delicious. I don't understand that. Deepa, you're you're a carrot girly. I don't like carrots. I wish I did because I feel like they're the perfect snack food. Um, preparing asparagus, I like um roasting it in the oven, or I'll um pan fry it. Yeah, roasted broccoli with lemon zest mm, is so good. Also, hi Greg, welcome in. Brussels sprouts are the true enemy? I think Brussels sprouts can be good if they're prepared the right way. But if they're not, they can taste very bitter and gross. Um, Though it's made out of ordinary material, I can sense some sort of warmth from it. Marvelous. You've nurtured a beautiful bond, a precious, irreplaceable bond. With Tanaka? <laughs> we nurtured a bond Very with well. Tanaka. It's beautiful and precious, as Elizabeth says. Um... Okay, there's Maiko. Guys, I might hang out with Kenji. I might hang out with him. Hey dude, <laughs> let's grab some seats. Up He's up. in this outfit again. Also, hi milkshake. Welcome in. Hi Jay. Broccoli's been your favorite green your whole life. Yeah, it's so good. Man. As soon as people let me add fat and cook it, broccoli got ooh a thousand times better. Mm. Broccoli's not your vibe, right? Oh my gosh. Watch Evan Children Theaters last Thursday. Someone behind me audibly went... <laughs> when you know who's been on your knees? Oh my god. That part sent me. I was like, there's no way. Also notice, hello, welcome in. Thanks for having your seat. How are you? Watching the humans fight for survival in that movie made me a little braver. We can't give up now. There's always hope, no matter how damned the world is. Man. God is my witness. Oh man, my hands were sweating like crazy. Everything was so well done. But dude, three movies in a row is way too much. Anyway, it's getting dark, so let's bounce. Did we see three movies in a row? Was today the film festival? Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. Three movies in a row with Kenji. Oh, welcome back. Hey. I can't take it anymore. It's too hot. <sighs> the next full moon is in September, right after break. When I talk about it like that, it sounds like I'm preparing for an exam or something. But anyway, there are only four shadows left. We have to hang in there. Maybe it if you wanna go ahead, we need to whatever I'm showing on my bed. Does the dog wanna watch TV? Whatever like is, we go for the way to say. Hey, 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 you're in the fire with the burning desire. Every day we inspire, but never expires. We can raise our academics by watching TV with Coro Maru. I'm so sorry, Coro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Koromaru. Oh, 
It just made him so sad. I was gonna go to I was gonna go to Tartarus today, you guys. Cause everyone's here. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. I'm being guilt tripped right now. I think I have to. I think I have to watch TV with him. Okay, okay, we'll watch TV with Koromaru. Cause he whined at us. But first let me talk to everyone. <laughs> We should follow Yukari-chan's advice and try to finish our summer homework soon. Junpei-kun said that he's gonna do all his all at once later. How are you gonna tackle yours? Little by little. I never did that. I was a procrastinator in school. It was so bad. Hi Shara, welcome in. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Oh god. I don't know. Hmm. Speaking of Karmar's meals, sometimes he looks like he wants to eat a beef bowl. But I guess it'd be better to just give him dog food. I know there are some foods that are dangerous to dogs, and it's not like he needs the stuff for his diet, right? What if he does, Aki? Greetings. The summer festival was an excellent experience. The rate at which the candied cotton substance expanded ex exceeded my expectations. I would like to make an expedition to the next summer festival as well. I'm glad she enjoyed herself. I can. Mitsuru san took Aiga san to the summer festival. I didn't hear anything on the news about it, so no one must have noticed that she's a robot. She must have been in stealth mode. Alright, Junpei wants to read. We're gonna go hang out with the dog. We're gonna hang out with Koro chan. Look how happy he is. I love his little portrait. Earth? <laughs> oh, stop. It's a documentary about a wolf pack. Oh my gosh, angry dog. Karmaru seems to be mimicking the pack leader. Woof woof. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Karamaru seems to really like this program. This makes me so happy. Watching how animals do in the wild helped me improve my academics. This program apparently has more episodes in the series. Yes, we can watch more with Koromo. That is so adorable. I cannot believe that. No, literally perfect use of our time. Tartarus can wait. We can go to Tartarus tonight, okay? <gasps> Junpei wants to hang out? But so does Bebe, you guys. I feel like we should go hang out with Junpei. I know, how are we supposed to choose? Nishiko, you want a Koro command? Should we just have it be Arf? Your summer break next year will likely be in in inundated with studying for entrance exams. So make a use of this free time while you have it. Hi, you're eating! It's just a little doggy. Is it still movie festival? I think it is. I feel like we should go hang out with Junpei though. Jay, thank you for doing time new. I hope you're doing well. 
Make me want to buy this game so bad. It seems so fun. Notice it is so fun. I love it so much. Um, okay. Also, so the solar. Thank you for adding that command. We can add a little Koro command. Okay. <laughs> as far as Persona mascots go, P3 wins. No, literally. We love the dog so much. Alright, there's Junpei. I don't know why, man, but I think I'm starting to fall for her. What should I do? I can't just keep doing nothing. Maybe I should go ahead and talk to her, you know? Stop. Is this what they call disillusionment? I didn't realize he was that kind of guy. I'm gonna stop following him. This is so disappointing. The last thing I need is another guy like him. No way. So... This girl is literally stalking this guy. Because she's obsessed with him. And this guy at first was like, no, you're weird. Why do you keep following me? And now he's actually falling for her. And she said, I don't want him. <laughs> like... <sighs> Sometimes I see that weird guy there. He's always banging away on that little laptop of his muttering to himself. And he's got that briefcase too. Is he like a day trader or something? A briefcase? At first I was like, Akechi? No, I think it's just, uh, the nerdy guy. <laughs> Alright, Junpei, let's hang out with you. Yo. <laughs> Invite her to play award-winning MMORPG Final Fantasy XIV, yeah. With free trial. <laughs> oh god, what is Junpei's idea? I'm gonna go buy the thing we need. Wait for me here. A watermelon? That's one magnificent melon, ain't she? It's the highlight of my day. So, I've been thinking of throwing a watermelon splitting party. How are we gonna do that? We haven't really done anything summery since vacation started, you know? Especially Amada. He always looks so bored when I see him in the dorm. Hmm. Man, that kills me to see. It'd be a real shame if he didn't have a single entry in his summer picture diary. A summer picture diary? Yeah, what are you really getting at? What's up? Honest to God, I just want the kid to have a fun summer. Junpei! Look into my eyes. But they lie to you? Oh, I mean, don't you know? What? They say women can't resist a guy with a soft spot for kids. <laughs> Shut up, Junpei! <laughs> and you know what that means? I'm gonna need your help. Stop! It's a win-win situation, don't you think? Yeah, you know, no oh boy. <laughs> I think my arms are gonna fall off. You're gonna drop the watermelon! Oh, uh, yes. oh my Maybe god, I'll send the dog to you Koro! Such a shame that the third years and the ladies won't be joining us. No, literally, it's just us. Um, if we're splitting watermelons, I'm out. <laughs> Why? What? Just like that? You're not even gonna hear me he out? He said, I don't want to be here. You have a watermelon and a bat. What else could it possibly be? <laughs> it's more for little kids anyway. Plus, it's really hot out. And look, I get you're trying to be nice. <gasps> Ken! Ken, you're literally zero years old. You are a little guy. You should join us. Yeah, for real. Without you, it would just be me and him, you know? And isn't that just the saddest thing you ever heard? Mm hmm Well, when you put it that way, I guess I don't have a choice. I know, Koromaru. Don't you worry, boy. We didn't forget about you. How is Koromaru gonna try and split the watermelon? All right, what are we wait for it. The youngest gets to drop first blood. Now this is what real summer feels like. My blood's pumping something fierce. 
Look who's acting like a kid now. <laughs> oh yeah, where's the blindfold? We can't split watermelons with just a blindfold. I have never heard of a watermelon splitting competition before. Ever. This is my first time hearing about this. Speaking of, this bat seems kind of worn in, doesn't it? Oh, wow. You got that. That bat and I go way back. Oh. Had it since I was in Little League. I've never you met bae? you before. It's your childhood bat. That's news to me. Wow. Uh, must have never had a chance to talk about it. That I used to play baseball. I mean, mm. anyway, that's old news now. No, keep telling us about yourself, Junpei. Wait, then should we really be hitting watermelons with this? Hmm? Nah, well, nah, it's cool. Don't think I'll be using it much from here on out. Why are you so, so sad, Junpei? Also, Parker, thank you for the 15 stream watch streak. I appreciate it. Oh, it's a, it's like a, it's a common thing in anime? That's interesting. I've never seen that before. Hmm. Mm. Koru can tell something's wrong. What's wrong, bud? Dying to chomp on some melon? Koro is trying to tell us something. Koromaru? We can't swing at the watermelon with you in the way. Koromaru? Hey, why don't we use something other than the bat? Yeah. What do you want to use? Um, anything, I guess. Just as long as it's interesting. Okay. <laughs> interesting? Kind of a weird request. Oh! Like if Sonata-san uses bare hands? Bare hands? Yeah, where's I guess when we need her, she can use her, her finger guns. Get Aki Someone in here. Yes, name? yes, yes. Whoa, Sonata-san. Whoa. <laughs> well, when I got back, I thought I heard voices coming from the roof. <laughs> so I came to check it out. Hmm. Watermelon splitting, huh? That's right. We were just talking about what to use. Oh to my hit god. It. Ken loves Aki. <laughs> Ken's like, oh my god. My idol. <laughs> You're not gonna use that bat? We want you to use your fists. My fists. On this? Mm hmm Oh my god, yes! I'd actually love to see that! <laughs> Ken! <laughs> That's okay, right, Jupe-san? Huh? Uh, oh. sure. If that's what you want. Alright. Guess I better make this good then. Yes! Oh my god! Everyone buckle up! Go off, Aki. Yay! Try not to go all out or there won't be any left to eat. Yo! <laughs> Sonata-san, you're incredible! What the heck? How are we supposed to eat it now? I mean, it looks fine. <laughs> Can't believe that thing was still edible after it exploded like that. Didn't go exactly how I was expecting, but it looked like a mod app. Oh, this is so nice. Yeah, where'd 75% of the watermelon go? It's gone. It's gone. Man, I was acting kind of lame back there, huh? Junpei? You know, before we busted the melon. I'm talking about the whole bat thing. You were just trying to be thoughtful. I didn't want to come off like I was having second thoughts. Aw, Junpei. Guess I couldn't help it, huh? I was supposed to be this cool mentor, but instead, the kid ends up hitting me. You did the best you could. <laughs> Don't worry about me anymore. I'll just get even sadder, you know? I mean, I'm not saying it's your- Sadder? Uh, how the hell do I put it? This is a me problem. It probably doesn't make sense. I 
feel like my life, my teenage years, it's just all over the place. Junpei, we were just having such a good time. Now I want to cry. I want to cry for you. I want to cry with you. Should we just like cry it out together? Anyway, uh, I think we're done for today. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Appreciate you helping me prep and clean up. Well, let's head back downstairs. He said my life is all over the place. Anyway. <laughs> that was so nice. That was really nice to talk to him. Also to hang out with Ken and Aki and Karo. There's a box on the counter. Oh yes, we got that. Thank you. Oh, it's you. So our break will be ending in just under two weeks. Of course, fighting shadows takes priority, but don't forget to dedicate time to studying as well. Man. Oh, Akuchi is here. What are y'all doing? Why are y'all just standing here? Okay, it's Tuesday. I really feel like we should maybe go to Tartar Sauce. I know, adorable interaction for sure. No girls around past today. Yeah, it was a good time. Koromaru isn't just an any old dog. He's a key member of C's. Please be mindful of what you're feeding him. Y'all, um, I was trying to cook something and kind of messed it up, and Horachan happened to be nearby, so I asked him if he wanted a bite. I was just joking, but he ran away so fast. I mean, I know it didn't come out right, but I didn't think it was that bad. Um, <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh -huh. Yukari, what did you make? I know Korachan didn't mean to hurt Yukari chan's feelings, but I'm sure she's feeling a little down. Not sure what to do in this kind of situation. <laughs> and Junpei's just out here laughing. Yukitan said that the food she made didn't turn out the way she expected, but even Koromaru ran away from it. How bad does your cooking have to be for that to happen? Yukari, you poor girl. Also, hi, HFLD, welcome in. Just woke up, good morning. How are you doing? Okay, anyone up here? <laughs> he seems, oh, he seems apologetic about something. Koro, why don't you go downstairs and it go by Yukari, because she's really sad. He's so cute. I love him so much. Man. <laughs> He's just a baby, right? Oh. Okay, let's see. No, I think I might go eat some food. Like, me, actually, I might go eat some lunch. Um... Let me see what's over here first. Tanaka's not here, you guys. Why am I kind of sad about that? Tanaka said bye forever, and he meant it. Man. Are links allowed in chat? Here, let me see. Do you want to try sending it to, um, a mod? I see Astral's here. Do you want to try sending it to Astral? And then, um, Astral could post it in chat? Otherwise, yeah, you could post it in Discord, too. Korogu's a cute sadness. Like, cute aggression, but you want to cry. Yeah, <laughs> if you want to cry. <laughs> I love him. Jung, is Kormar's Bay an actual person? That's hilarious. Okay. Used all Tanaka time. Yeah, now we can only see our father on TV. I hate calling him our dad. Oh my god. But I think I am gonna go eat some food, y'all. So, I'm gonna take a, a break. Like 15 or 20 minutes. Um, I will turn on words on stream. And let's see how far we can get. 
How far can we get today? What's for lunch? Okay, I actually made myself a enchilada bake last night. So I'm planning on having that. I can't wait. It was so good. All right, guys. Um... Window capture. There we go. Meal preppers. I know. I'm like, I'm so proud of myself. I'm so proud of myself with the meal prepping. All right, I'm going to turn on words on stream. Uh, let me make sure that slow mode is off. There we go. Y'all, give me like 20 minutes so I can eat. Thank you all so much for hanging out. Um, and have fun with words on stream. Hopefully we'll get past level 31 this time. Who knows if that'll happen. I appreciate y'all. One sec.
likes to the sound that goes around and round and round and round. She said, Hey, 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 feeling the fire with the burning desire. Every day we inspire, but never expires. But we will chill today, let me ride the world tomorrow. Yeah.
time I love, the sun I'm on, any time surprise, yeah I'm down, sit back, relax, to the sound that goes around, 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 she said, hey, 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 feeling the fire with the burning desire, every day we inspire, but never expires, but we will chill today, let me ride the world tomorrow, yeah.
likes to the sound that goes around and round and round and round. She said, Hey, 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 feeling the fire with the burning desire. Every day we inspire, but never expires. But we will chill today, let me ride the world tomorrow. Yeah. So over, you guys, we were so close. We were so close. 
Yo, one day, one day we're gonna get to this level 31, okay? I promise you. That was so sad. We were so close. Oh, it's fine. It's okay. Hello. One more. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We're gonna. We can do one more on Wednesday. All right. Let me. Let me switch back over here. Man. Oh. Well. <laughs> yeah. One day we're gonna prove that we're literate. Uh huh. We're okay. <laughs> Hi, Lynn, welcome back. Hello. Yes, allowed you to catch up to the live stream. I did have a good lunch. I had some, um, I had an enchilada bake. It was delicious. I also made myself some homemade brownies last night. So I had a little, a little piece of a brownie. It was so good. Oh, frick, ads just started. I should have ran ads when we were playing, um, words on stream. God damn it. Um, put the coral emotes in the P3 channel discord. Okay, everything's sensitive, spoiled in there. I'm s I'm so scared to check. <laughs> ah, let me. Dude, you wanna whisper it to me? Yeah, that would be better. If you still have the link, or if one of my mods wants to put it um in the mod channel Discord, or you can whisper it to me, one of my mods. If not, that's okay, and I can find it later. Um, came for P3, yes. Yeah, stayed for word games. I do love the little word games. Kind of gets your gets your brain thinking and everything. Yeah, the brownies were so good. They'll make me learn new words. No, literally, Giselle. <laughs> some some people put words in there, and I'm like, I have never heard of that word in my life. Nina, bless your soul. Thank you so much. Maru sits. Hello. Stop. That's so cute. Coral walkies. Hello. That's so cute. Oh, I love them. Thank you so much, Nina. I appreciate that. Yeah, look at him go. He's just walking. Also, if y'all can't see those emotes. Um, you can check out BTTV. BTTV is a browser extension. Uh, lots of Twitch channels use BTTV. Um, but if you download it on your browser, you'll have a bunch of new emotes that will show up in chat. It's very cool. Um, Rusty Cole, thank you so much for the 10 months. I appreciate it. The Latro, I have not heard of that actually. I don't know if, um... I don't know if I'm saying that right. Yeah. Man. I do not have 7 TV, no. I know, he's so cute, the Koromaru sits. Koro... Koro walkies? Yeah, Koro walkies. <laughs> I love it so much. <laughs> okay. I'm back. Y'all, I think what we're gonna do is go to Tartar Sauce today. Yeah, I don't use 7 TV. I like, I don't have it downloaded anything. 7 TV was created because someone tried to upload a racist emote to BTV. And it got removed, so they used 7 TV to get around that. Mmm, that's so sad. Yeah. Oh, I think my controller's dead too. Create a whole new browser extension for that? <laughs> I just want to know why people are like this. That's so upsetting. Well, that's good to know, though. Thank you for sharing that, Doug. Um, yeah, we'll just keep using BTTV. Kawamaru sits. Yeah, it, it's with the capital, capital K and capital S. Okay, y'all. We are on August 18th. Um... I think I think we're gonna go to Tartarus. I think I should go see the fortune teller first and maybe try to get one of those rarity fortunes um, And I think we're gonna be able to see Koro With his persona and actually I wanted to read about the other people's personas in our party because we haven't done that yet I haven't done that in a while actually So we go to the club Oops, oops. 
friendly man, you're still dancing. Oh yeah, there was a summer there was that summer festival, huh? Damn it. I didn't have anyone to go with. Oh well, it probably wasn't that great. I mean I had a fun time. Lucky colors? Colors affect your look. I've actually never heard of that before. Three blades close in on you, tearing the shadow apart. A brave howl confronts them. Things seem to be stirring around you once again. In the depths of the abyss, another blade watches you closely. Let's hope that you find fortune in your destiny. What do you mean by that? Okay, I want to know my fortune. What kind of fortune do you seek? Let's take... The rarity fortune. Yes. Alright, cool. Now we can go to tartar sauce. Pookie, thank you for the 10 stream watch streak. Welcome in. What did everyone else have for lunch or for dinner? Um. Fuka. Um. Let's go to tartar sauce. Yes. <gasps> you had pho? That sounds so good. I haven't had pho in so long. Tuna mayo? Mmm. Nina, did you have it, um... Do you have it, like, in a rice bowl? Are you- are you kidding me? Look at this dog! Oh my god! <laughs> Someone's all ready to go. But hey, do you think Koromaru actually understands what we're doing? I feel like he does. I'm sure he does. Think so? Even if he can use a persona, he's still a dog, you know? Hey, Koromaru. So, which is it? Oh. <laughs> are you ready to go? Or where are you going? Huh? Nothing. He said, resolve is shown through actions. <laughs> uh, but he's just a dog. <laughs> what a freaking badass. You are the coolest dog. So true. Oh, I love him. Uh, oh. Your maximum HP will increase by 10. Amazing. <gasps> Oh, that's so nice. Okay, cool. Um, ah, that's right. There's something I wanted to tell you. It seems Kor- Oh, that's right. Someone said this. I think it was I guess who said this. Koroshan actually has two theurgies. We're not totally sure why that's the case, but it's certainly nice to have him on our side. Okay. We have to have the dog in our party. Arf. Yes. Excuse Arf. <laughs> Koro's sake, I'm ready. <laughs> okay, we have the dog. We have Koro. Wait, we should see. Um, we should see what Koro has. Cerberus, level thirty-five. <gasps> of course, of course, it's the three-headed Cerberus. Ooh, we have dark moves, medium dark damage, and fire. The giant hound that guards the great abyss, Tartarus. He answers to Hades, the lord of the underworld, and keeps watch for both intruders and escapees. Eh, escapees? Not escapees. <laughs> he was born from Typhon and e Echidna, and is the older brother of Orthrus. Cool. Also, hi, Trev, welcome back. I think I, I missed some messages about what y'all had for lunch. Pookie, you got back from rock climbing? I hope you had the best time. I wanna go rock climbing. Had a leftover burger? Mmm, we love a nice grilled burger. Tonkatsu sounds delicious. Epic, you had chicken soup. 
Giselle, you had a whack ass salad. Ooh, lettuce is old and wrinkly. I'm so sorry. Giselle, did you get it from somewhere? And it was bad? Also, Isaiah, hello, welcome in. Thank you for grabbing your seat. Leech, you did your best McConter impression and gripped a burger with all your might. <laughs> Another person with a burger. Luke had chicken. Jeremy, you had tingly chili noodles. Oh my god, by Momofuku. Jeremy, are those the ones? Like the, the instant noodles? Because I have the soy and scallion ones. And I had that yesterday. They're so good. I haven't tried the, um, the chili ones though. I bet they're delicious. Um, you had it on rice with seaweed mm, and sesame seasoning. I love that. Eating, uh, is it sofopias? Is that how you say it? Sweet snack, perfect for a rainy day. I love it. Man. <laughs> Who is Eska? I don't know. You had up dog for lunch. Mm, um, I'm gonna ignore that. <laughs> Hi, Envy. Welcome in. Just got a bed, so no food for you. I hope you get food soon. Um, we had poutine. Oh my god, poutine sounds good. A feta cheese fried egg and avocado taco, lamb. That sounds fancy. Oh god, I have to sneeze. Oof. Oh, got it from Amazon delivery, so you didn't really pick it out. Giselle, what is this Amazon delivery you keep talking about? So I think you talked about that, or like Chris mentioned something about it in his stream yesterday. Okay, wait, let me read about Aegis' persona. Palladian? A guardian statue in ancient Greece stolen from Troy that protected the city in which it was enshrined. It is said that Athena was so saddened by the death of her friend Pallas that she had the wooden statue made in her image. Interesting. Itsuru, did you read? Did we read about yours? <laughs> a queen of the Amazons in Greek mythology, she fought for the Trojans during the Trojan War, but was slain by Achilles. When Achilles took off her helmet and saw her beautiful face, he felt great remorse for killing her. Well, Achilles, why would you do that? Okay, we're gonna take. I yes. guess. And we need a healer, so Yukari. Hmm. Okay, wait. I might take Akihiko, because he also has healing abilities. Hmm. And I miss him. <laughs> yeah, I hope the up dog was good, Larry. <laughs> okay, let me save. Here it comes! Ground floor 91. Oh god. No, I don't want to do that. I'm gonna wait till I'm a bit more... A bit more, um, powerful. Open up. God, I hope this new section doesn't look like the one we were just in. I'm gonna be really upset. Is your endgame tea really? <sighs> I know, Mitsuru's bench again. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> I love Koro. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. I think I need to blow mine up this one sec. Apologies, I had to blow my nose. This is your team too, really, Trev? Um. Oh no, it looks the same. There isn't much cover in this area, so we'll be spotted more easily. Great. 
Get over here. It's been so long. Ooh, look at these guys. Replace Korra with Yukari. Oh, this is your FPS endgame team? I know Aki with <laughs> the gloves. Oh, look at Koro. He's so cute. Okay, let's see. Stop. Let's see how this works. Koro-chan's collar is working. He can summon his persona. <laughs> He's mad. <laughs> He's a mad dog. <laughs> Barking! <laughs> oh my god, I love him so much! What's going on? This is incredible. Let's take this. Love having an animal team who's actually just an animal. Yeah, instead of a weirdo in a suit! <gasps> Woof, woof, woof. That's all it says. It just says woof, woof, woof. I love him. As they say. Oh, Koro Chan, you were my favorite. I can't believe we just have an animal on the team. Koro Chan doesn't need a leash or anything. Oh my god. Oh, get over here, you dumb bitch. Of course, the accuracy and innovation is up. Fuck. Yeah, Koro, I'm feeding you kibble. Enjoy your kibble. This is incredible. <gasps> Araki says, Good boy. Oh my god. <laughs> um. I love you so much. That was weird. Um. Can we try fire? Her leader took one out. I'll take care of this. I've got this. Okay, we really just need to get rid of this hand, to be honest. Fuck! I really should not have. Oh. It's fine. You go, Koro chan. Now that was rude. Aki, I love you. Okay, wait a goddamn minute. Let's get going. Koro chan, do you have different outfits? Winged? Oh, that's his everyday suit? Morgana! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Look at little Morgana! Carl has Morgana! <laughs> this is so cute! He has a little yellow bandana and everything! Okay, we have to- we have to see what he looks like. We're gonna if he slayed so real. Um Did we Oh, here are the stairs. A staircase. Cool. A staircase. All clear to proceed. <laughs> Let's go. Oh my god, you guys are almost spotted. Awaiting order. We're almost a floor one hundred. He looks like a cat. Like he actually looks like a cat here. <laughs> uh oh. Oh no! <laughs> Poor Koro! What 
Let's go. Morgana feels actually good and not a weirdo. Poor Morgana. It's snowing. Wait, is it actually snowing outside, Kyle? That's crazy. We were just talking about that this morning. Um, do we want? Let's take this. It's like 60 degrees here. It's so nice. I agree, Jeff. I like Morgana too. I'm a Morgana oh, defender. He can be annoying. He can be weird to on. Liz, for you too? My god, what's happening? It's it's not even March yet. Ooh, Koro's mad. I I love him so much. This is actually ridiculous. Hmm. Maybe try wind? <gasps> Hound of Hades! I cannot wait to see that. Okay. Go off, Makoto. One time Koro got knocked down, value start tearing up Edgy. I'm so sorry. He does not deserve that. Oh, that sucked. Hi, Nicholas. Welcome in. How are you? Oh. Go off. <laughs> Can you stop? Oh my god, poor Aki. Okay, what haven't we tried? We haven't tried light. Okay, last thing that I try. That's rude. That's rude. Nicholas, I'm good. I'm glad that you're doing well. Person that's going great. How you been a good weekend? Nicholas, are you excited for Rebirth coming out? Oh, let's take the Arcana card. Yes. Didn't really expect cool to wake us. Arcan? Expect. Wait, Astro, what? I don't get it. Is nearby. Um... Okay. Um. No, I don't think we need to head back. We do need to uh, heal up Aki, though. There you go. You can't have Kara on your team because you can't take him when he gets hurt. The poor baby. Yes, we are. <laughs> Do not perceive my typos. <laughs> I will not look. They're acting strange, almost fidgety, restless. The shadows here? That's kind of weird. It's kind of suspicious. Will you open it? Get over here. What a good little doggy. We definitely have to check out the other, um, the other, what are they called? Outfits that he has? Kuro's never left your team. You gave him all your instants and he's a monster now as he should be. That's incredible. Okay, we're gonna take the XP. God, I'm just, I'm obsessed with this screen. <laughs> he's so cute. <laughs> Getting too excited for seven. Probably gonna get it late because you got the. Oh, the collector's edition had just shipped. 
Are you telling me you get 19 inches of Sephiroth? I'm jealous. That chest looks like it's worth opening. I should have bought that, but it was like $500. <laughs> okay. Koro. Koro. Yasugami. Hey, I can't see. I can't see you. Okay, you know what? Well, I guess we'll see what it looks like in battle. Oh, wait. That, that enemy is acting kind of weird. Please consider turning back. Is that... that shadow seems especially aggressive, doesn't it? Oh, they may already be afflicted with status ailments. Hmm. They will charge upon spotting you, but struggle to redirect the force of their trajectory. Keep calm, sidestep, and wait for your opening to attack. Girl, what? We have to dodge in this game? Shadow sighted. Initializing combat mode. Easy peasy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Should we try this? Hello, enemies defeated. Good work out there. Coro, you're so good. You're so good at that. <laughs> Oh my god! I have his little walk! Like, are you kidding me? Uh, cruel attack. Medium pierce damage? We'll replace this. Wow. Yeah, the insta-kill. What a good little dog! <laughs> Karamar walkies. BTTV also has a pet in Korma remote. I would love to see it. If you want to send it to one of my mods, then they could post it in chat and I could add it. Oh, there's a treasure chest. Yeah, Korra is the main character. We have to stand. Nicholas, need to redo your room because you have so much collections. Oh, you want to display? Yeah. Oh god, I don't like these things. Light damage? Let's go, Aki. He's a Shiba! He's a little Shiba Inu? Oh, I've always wanted a Shiba Inu, but... One, I think they're expensive? And they're like, hard to find. Uh, okay, we'll take this persona. Go off, Aki. Did y'all know that Akiko's voice actor is a streamer? He's a VTuber. And he's so entertaining. That just looks valuable. Let me tell y'all, I did not understand the appeal of VTubers. I'm like, why would why would people want to watch that? I don't know. And then I watched uh, Sayu. That's his VTuber name. And I'm like, wait. I think I understand now. <laughs> um, he's an albino Shiba. Okay. Yeah, Mitsuru's VA streams too. I saw that. Aki's VA, Mitsuru's VA, and Yukari's. Wait, who is? Who is Yukari's? It might be the voice Paki. Yeah. Um. Okay, a theurgy. <gasps> Next. Okay, so two theurgies. One is Hound of Hades. Two is power howling. Next physical attack will deal more than double the damage for all allies. That's so nice. Let's see what Hound of Hades looks like. Let's do it on this one. <laughs> Let's 
go! Let's go, Koro! I, <laughs> I love him! He's such a good boy! <laughs> Go Makoto! Oh my god! They are amazing! Nice! We're getting so many personas. Koromaru-san seems to be pleased. Well done. Oh, Alex Lee too! Um... Yeah, he does YouTube stuff. Yukari says Heather Gonzalez. Okay, I'll have to check that out. Alex Lee is also voicing the main character of- yes, yeah, solo leveling, he's- I forgot the main character's name. Yes. I find it so funny that Alex Lee is also, um, what's his face from Demon Slayer? Zenitsu? Like, such- the range that he has <laughs> is crazy. Uh, let's play. Here we go. Stairs located. <laughs> you like Alex Lee? Me too, Astral. Oh shit, not one of these. Um I know the new season's coming out, y'all. Are you excited? Did anyone go see the Demon Slayer movie this past weekend? I I, I feel like I shouldn't say movie because it was just like. I will not run out of firepower. Thanks, I guess. I feel like I shouldn't say movie because there's literally like three episodes and then one new episode. Let's go. Demon Slayer is at its best with Zenitsu sleeping! <laughs> uh oh. That's what you get. <laughs> nice. Liz, I saw that too. Yeah, I saw people being disappointed that was mostly recap. They're like, I paid $20 for a movie ticket for this. Well done. <laughs> it's kind of sad. But does anyone know if there's a timeline for the new Demon Slayer season? That chest looks like it's worth opening. Yeah, that's true. Larry it was said that it would be like a uh, retelling or reshowing of the episodes. Yeah. Um. Angie, thanks for lurking. Must take my own chorus though. Angie, enjoy. Should be in spring. Okay. April. I hope April. That's what, like two months away? Aki, I love you so much. He's so intense. We do not need this. I feel like I should probably go to the velvet room soon. That certainly went well. A homunculus, thank you. Uh Shadow detected nearby. It's by you. This is gonna be like four episodes. What? Oh no. Is it really that short? 
think next enemy things you're looking forward to are ReZero Season 3. Oh yeah, and the Chainsaw Man movie. The Chainsaw Man movie comes out... This? This year, right? I like... I don't know what I'm excited for. I mean, obviously Demon Slayer. Oh yeah, Oshinoko. Oshinoko is coming out this year, which I was surprised about. Oh, Troubled, are you talking about the Avatar live action? Um, okay, Ice. Yeah, I haven't watched it yet. I would like to though, I'd like to try it out. I know a lot of people don't like it. But, um, I don't know. Hi, Wasteman Potential. Thought it was good for what it was. I know, Chainsaw Man movie. You know what actually surprises me about Chainsaw Man? I actually see a lot of people complaining about Chainsaw Man in the first season. And I was really surprised by that because I thought it was done so well. Granted, I did not read the manga. <laughs> Excuse me. But, um... Oh god, am I out of focus? Yes. I thought it was so cinematic. Chainsaw Man, I mean. Um, and then I saw people complaining about the director and how he directed it. And I'm like, what? Like, I understand that it wasn't... They didn't have the same exact frames that the manga has, but it was done so well. I don't know. Um, let's get money. Yeah, Giselle, you love it. Oh, Liz, you're at the manga too? I did not know that. Larry, you're a Chainsaw Man hater. Why is that? I think it's fine if you hate it. I'm just curious on why. Okay, wait, let's... Let's get this. Do I really want to go in here? You know what? Maybe I should. Aki wants to. He's just standing here. <laughs> Matter is directed like a movie and not goofy enough. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let me give Koro some uh some SP. Okay, I think we're good. Get some shots for it one to one like the manga. Yeah, anime is amazing. Charles, you're a manga reader too. <laughs> I don't approve the phrase man hater, yeah. <laughs> Heard some Japanese fans say the voice acting wasn't good. Really? That's interesting. What's on Aki's hands, Raz? These are his Jack Brothers gloves. Aren't they so funny? I love them so much. <laughs> I'll do it. All right. Shit, I should have done the little defense oh, thing see. that um, Fuka has. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh god. Do we have a like a cure all? No fuck. How about any items? For all allies? Okay, we're gonna do this. We're gonna increase Makoto's defense. Here we go. <laughs> Trev's so real. 
Um, don't have a good reason to dislike Chainsaw Man, just animation and one certain scene turned you off from it. Okay, I gotcha. Should we Chainsaw Man season one a bit longer? Oh, like 24 episodes! I guess I can't really say how long they should have made because I don't know, like... I don't know the manga plot points and stuff. But yeah. Um... Have you seen how tiny Polyduces' feet and hands are? I don't think so. But Trev... He reminds me of, um... <laughs> Bebe. <laughs> I'm like, that's Bebe if Bebe was a persona. <laughs> Oh shit. Weeks of wind, nice. Don't say- okay listen! Does he not look like Bebe? I will show you guys next time that I summon Aki's persona. We're gonna heal, heal ourselves. See, look at him! Oh my god, wait! He does have small feet and hands! That's funny. Let's go! A critical! Thank you so much, Koro! <laughs> that Teddy command! I forgot we had that Teddy command. Let's go. Uh, let's do these Jack Brothers. <laughs> this makes me so happy. Bear Sona! Oh, brother. Oh, <laughs> brother. Bear Sona. Um. Ooh, okay, we're gonna take this Lover's Arcana. <laughs> we have so- we have so many Teddy commands. Oh, hello. Uh, this is so funny. Get me out of here. I love this team so much. Hi, Chimp. Welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Um, okay. Let's go to the next floor. Ooh, there are the little thingies. Man. We have the advantage. So many commands. For every single persona game, honestly. Actually, probably every single game that, <laughs> that we played on here. Nice. <laughs> Narcissus? We have to take it. Let's get rid of Neko Shogun? Sure. Slayer! Wait, what's happening? We'll never forget the haunting line. The plot thickens, Teddy thickens. What? When was that? Koromaru-san appears satisfied with our performance. <laughs> when was that? Oh no! This big. I'm gonna cry. With a lot of people here on <laughs> yeah, Naruse. You know, literally, every time I see um, the person of Narcissus, I'm like, that's. Actually, Naruse. Oh, 
Nice. Good boy. Coral is so angry. Imagine voicing Koro. You just gotta- Oh, you gotta summon your inner alpha wolf. <laughs> Luna, hello, welcome in. Yes, Koro's here. You send it in Discord? Okay, I'm gonna have to watch that after stream. This justice card is amazing. Thank you so much, Catchy. Good teamwork, everyone. Now on to the next. Um. Oh, we can just go to the next floor. Cool. Inside of you, there are three core Mars. Mm -hmm. Please be careful. Ooh. Leader. Okay. Uh. Oh, we're, we're almost to floor 100, you guys. Okay, we're gonna save. We're gonna go to the Velvet Room, and then we will fight those... those personas. I guess I sh should say shadows. Oh, it's just an image? Welcome to the Velvet Room. I hate that so much. I hate that so much. Oh, it was from OG Persona 4, not in Golden. That's gonna haunt me forever, Cupid. Larry, if you were in Persona, you'd for sure be an alpha wolf. That's good to know. Okay. I was gonna ask what everyone thinks their Persona would be. But I feel like I should just ask what your favorite Persona is. Me, personally, I'm trying to think of, um, the one I really like. Yoshitsune? I freaking love Yoshitsune so much. Okay, we need to register these. Well then, have you all the element? What kind of persona? Loki! Jab, yes, Loki's so good too. Throbbing Kingdom Desire, Larry. Larry. Why would you say that? <laughs> okay. If it's not Jack Frost, you're wrong. Honestly, Hatter, you have a point with that. This persona is powerful. Shining arrows? Oh, yes. I think we need to make Kaguya right now. Okay. What do you wish to inherit? Kaguya's in a different persona game? I didn't know that. Um, ice. Defense. Hmm. It seems you have been blessed with some sure <laughs> why this is exciting isn't it i am kaguya thou who challenged the challenge the <laughs> challengeth the peculiar moonlight let me be thy strength <laughs> hi mitsuru karijo p3 how are you <laughs> <gasps> oh my gosh, Nidhog! I want to make him so bad, V. Okay. Loa. This persona is powerful. Ooh. I guess we can make you. you. Oh, you're the you're the death arcana. Okay. I like Auto Rakukaja. It will receive a good amount of extra power. Okay, it yeah. Appears. It will receive a good amount. Wait, no, of I don't want that. Power. Fuck. You know what? No, we're going to take it. it. <laughs> Sorry. So it begins. Man, you like Kaguya a lot? 
You see yours would be uh Kushi Narahime. I don't know if I've seen that one. Um it has to be like Gabriel, yeah, okay. I really like a lot of the um justice personas and not not because of Akechi. Okay, I just wanna say that. I think the justice personas are so cool. A lot of them are um like the the guardian angels. I love it. Yo, let's go. <gasps> That's so nice. Okay, cool. Sarasvati. Yakshini? Is this acceptable? She's so cool. I love Yamata no Orochi though. They've been such a good persona for me. I don't know if I want to get rid of them. Is this acceptable? Virtue. Oh, hello. Look at the booty cheeks. <laughs> I've never seen this persona before. <laughs> the fifth of the nine orders of angels, also known as the shining ones. They work miracles and support those struggling with their faith. God damn. I feel like we need to make it. But we just made Loa! Fuck. <gasps> you guys! There's Mothman! Is this <laughs> oh my god! I feel like we have to make Mothman! But Loa! We could- okay, wait. We could always summon Loa back. Right? Okay, wait. Let me make sure that I register. Will you register it um, um... I just want to make sure that Please I have... Take a look. Uh... One was it Loa? Loa, Loa's there. All right. Ah, well. We're gonna make Mothman, and then maybe we we'll look? we'll summon Virtue again to make. I mean, we'll summon Loa to make Virtue. Persona, yes? I love Mothman so much. Please choose what skills to inherit. Um, Wind. I mean, if we get- if we get Loa back, we're gonna have all these skills already. Maybe I'll take this. It will receive a larger... <laughs> a new power emerges. <laughs> Look at him! I'm Mothman. I now know who me. You and me the same. Yes? <laughs> He's so good. There's literally nothing happening behind those eyes. <laughs> Whoa! Distress boost, electric boost. <gasps> Maggie, Megido, hello? He's got almighty damage. My guy, what the hell? Okay. Registering persona. This is your progress so far. We're getting Loa. Please take this. This is expensive. Fuck. Oh my god, it's so expensive. It's fine. Mothman really does know who me, right? He's a little cryptid. Can see him flying into light bulbs. I, I can see will. it too. Shall we take a look? This persona, yes. Fuck. I think we might have to wait to make virtue, you guys. Well, I don't know. I just really want to take all these dark moves. You know what? I don't care. We Please have dark moves with Koro. You think Satanel's one of your favorites, Trev? Satanel's very cool. Immediately if you use your Mothman away to make Sati? Sati? I don't know if I've made Sati. Um... I'm alone right now. <laughs> the virtue. The way he's a justice persona. 
Oopie. This is what I'm saying, you guys. All the justice personas are hot. Um. Okay, let's take this. The Kaja and... It Lightning, sure. <laughs> Why, this is exciting, isn't it? Him. Oh my god. I am virtue. The power of my brilliant light shall shield you from peril. Light boost. Amazing. King Frost? Y'all. Yeah. This would be a wise choice. There's just... There are too many good personas that we're coming across. Oh, here's Sati. <gasps> You're so right about this, Manda. She is hot. She's literally burning. She's on fire. <laughs> what? What's going on? Is this acceptable? Game is this acceptable? Hi. This persona is powerful. This one is somewhat beneath you. Wow. Woman is mother. Please choose the personas you would like to fuse. Um. Take this persona is powerful. If we do this. Please yeah, choose yeah, what yeah. skills to inherit. It appears to receive a good amount of extra power. Yeah, that's fine. Well, okay. Shall we be Also, thanks for the follows, everyone. I appreciate it. Angie, welcome back. <sighs> Fiance absolutely adores Samuel. Samuel? I'll have to find them. Why don't I try to use all the four lords personas? Oh, yeah. Lunch, I have not gotten an infusion accent yet. I'm kind of scared because I've been infusing a lot today. So... Okay, this is a pineapple question. What do soul seed droplets do? Because I feel like I've gotten a lot of those for my personas and I have no idea what they do. What kind of persona <gasps> do Sarah you, you can't control well. this one yet? Use them in a shop? Bring them to the antique shop. Okay. Oh, oh I see. Yeah, we already unlocked the antique shop. Okay, okay. Gotcha. You can't control this. Is this acceptable? Genbu! Y'all are right! The four lords! Yes. Genbu! From 14! <laughs> Okay, I think that's all. Very well. That's all we got. Okay, um... Let's leave. We look forward to your next visit. One only fusion next and you got Morgana's persona Zoro. That's... did you... did you like that? Cause that would be kind of cool. Alrighty, let's look at our personas. What do we have? We have Kaguya with um, ice and light. Ice, light, wind, electric. Fire and light, dark. And we have Almighty. I cannot believe. <laughs> I cannot believe that Mothman has Almighty damage. Who am I? So true, Mothman. <laughs> I know Orpheus is still there. I don't know what to do with him. Okay. Mothman's the strongest one, I think. Actually, I don't know. I haven't looked at their stats, but I like to think that he's the strongest. I'm not ready. Yes. Yes. Okay. Um. Let's do 
this. This will be fun. Come on, let's move. Three enemies. Be careful. Uh oh. <laughs> Go off, Koro. Hmm. Let's use this. Okay, that one's weak to electric. Um, <laughs> Karachan is perfect. That isn't a philosophical question yet. Mothman actually has no idea who he is. <laughs> Is that I feel like he Ready to switch in. I feel like he uses a lot of SP. Just because his magic attacks hit so hard. We have seen his all on attack screen. It's so cute. He's such a cutie patootie. We cannot pass this up. Do you see the way he jumped in the background? Oh my god. Thank you for the heal. Let's go, Mothman. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, twenty one thousand SP. Holy Let's shit. Electric boost. I guess we can get rid of, rid of that. Okay. Nice. Medium chance. Oh, that's good. Okay. Greetings. Confirmed annihilation of enemy shadow. We are victorious. Kormarstan performed excellently as well. Once we return, we are to give you a reward, correct? <laughs> what would best suffice as a reward for Koromaru san? Oh, do, do we want to give him a snack? Does, do, does he want some brush? Some brushing? Hmm, a snack. Mm hmm. <laughs> Koromaru san, you are drooling. Kormarasan is exuberant. Perhaps he is one hungry boy, as they say. Oh my god. I will also perform to the best of my ability in order to secure Kormarasan the best possible reward. I am obsessed with him. This is the best game ever. Okay. Were I able to travel at light speed, I could reach the top instantly. I'd rather not take the easy way out. I'll get to the top of my own two feet. Okay, Aki. Okay. <laughs> Not bad. Um, here you can I have it. it. Ooh, ooh, emo the coral pet emo. Oh, coral pet. I edited it. <laughs> 
<laughs> in the book core, can we talk about Mothman? Listen, we love Mothman here too. Oh, there you go. All the pets for Koro. What a year for dogs and gaming, you guys. Oh, hello. We're on the 100th floor, holy shit. That's a mind-boggling number, but the end's not even in sight. Well, there's no hurry, so let's keep a steady pace. Oh, there's a treasure chest. We got Koro, Koro-chan, MP3. We had Torgal in Final Fantasy 16. I love it. That does really good damage. I'm still setting up. It'll take a little more time. One step at a time. Let's go. The enemy is down. We cannot pass this up. God damn. Oh, yes, we get one more. Oh, that's so good. Um, let's get money. Holy crap, I love the Justice Arcana. Being able to take two cards during shovel time is incredible. Teamwork, everyone. Now on to the next. Hi, Chris. Welcome back. Yeah, Red from Seven Rebirth. Red, Red has a cat. That's true. I can't wait for Red though. We have arrived at the one hundredth floor. Did you just hear her? Hello. I wish I could replay that. She said, "Ta-da!" <laughs> Yang, exactly! They're the best! Red's a lab rat dog? I actually don't know. I always thought he was like, um, a lion of some sort. I don't remember, to be honest. Um, uh, anti ice master? Nice. Just like we planned. Yeah, Seema as a cat dog. Mm. That certainly went well. I'm just excited for Seven Rebirth. I'm sitting here excited they're playing Dragon Quest X in English. Oh, speaking of animals, dogs. Well, Miso's a cat, but he just came up here. Hi, Miso. Are you gonna lay down? Hi, cutie patootie. <laughs> You're so cute, so I love you so much. Where are you going? Here we go. What you doing? Okay. Hi! What was that? I just missed what <laughs> was on screen. Um, because Miso is distracting me. Oh, it was a clock! Okay. Let's find this clock. Hey! <laughs> Not Junpei time! <laughs> Poor Junpei. I actually don't know who this could be for. I fucking love this music so much. Also, I'm sorry, I'm like, I'm swearing a lot today. I don't mean to. Oh. Mitsuru? Holy shit. Mitsuru is my lowest. Uh, and Junpei. Okay. 
I'm so sorry, you guys. I, I feel like I haven't really been using her a lot. Welcome back. Hey, Makoto. Um... I don't really want to. <laughs> I'm sorry! I really like the team that I have right now. I mean... Okay, maybe we'll put in Mitsuru for, I guess... Hmm. Yeah. I'm so sorry, I guess. <laughs> yeah, the clock is helpful. You really want to put Junpei on your team? Already had Igus. Oh, didn't need more physical? Yeah, yeah. Never used Mitsu. Yeah, because you always you always had ice on you, exactly. That's how I feel. Okay. Um Yes, let's go. Can I give you a clock pineapple? Sure. What's up? I know Koro does not have a lot of SP. But he has his his energy thing. <laughs> um, you're November and June pays at oh level thirty seven. Oh, well, let's look at my party. I think I actually have to take June pay. Oh, you do. Okay, you have to do a single battle with Junpei and Mitsu to get them uh, the levels from the clock. Okay. Junpei, <laughs> you're coming with me. I'm so sorry, Aki. But maybe I should swap out for Koromar because Kor does not have a lot of SP. I'm sorry. Goodbye, dog. Um. That makes me sad. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Here we go. Um. When you're in January and June is at <laughs> 28, <laughs> holy shit. <laughs> That's so why is that hilarious? To me? Lisa, you kinda stink. You're kinda stinky. Damn it. Okay. I can take over any time. You go, Jun A. Look at these boys. I love them! Slayers! Would play play Dark Knight because he thinks it's edgy, Amanda? Maybe. Um. There we go. Doesn't look like we'll be needing a ten cap. You don't hate Junpei, just don't use them when they're- Oh, when there's Igus? Yeah. I like Junpei. Okay. Do we really need fire break? See, I say do we need fire break, and then the last boss fight that we had, I was like, wow, it would be really nice to have some sort of break moves on. I'm still gonna forget it. <laughs> I've learned a new skill. Let's go. Ice break. I don't want this. I never use spirit drain. Tentarafu. Distress or charm. I think I would rather have confuse. Okay. We've reached the hundredth floor. I guess that counts as some sort of milestone. <laughs> Aki's so funny. We're doing well. Let's keep up the pace. Careful, the enemy's nearby. <laughs> you can do it! Shall I move to strike? 
Oh, come on. They're both weak to lightning? Did y'all celebrate the 100th day of school year when you were younger? I don't think so. I've never heard of that. Nice. No, I just haven't heard it's going down now in a while. <laughs> Start tweaking. I'll try to get a it's going down now in the next enemy that we fight. Um, can I please have an Arcana card? Please? Thanks. Lost three fingers on my right hand, so I asked my doctor if I'd still be all right with it. He said maybe, but it wouldn't count. Oh, ratchet, please. Just wondering. What the hell? I <laughs> I'm so sorry, Cupid. Um. That was bad. I think I have to get a C's advantage. No, we're not gonna escape. Liz, you remember celebrating 100 days of school? Only in the, um... Really young grades? Gotcha. I don't know that at all. Uh... I'll take this. And XP. Doesn't look like we'll be needing a 10 count. Slay and serve. Teamwork, Aki. everyone. Now on to the next. Okay. We gotta go this way. Shadow, what will you do? There we go. <laughs> we took the initiative. Group of okay. the go for it. I've got the lighter. Not bad. Nice. Let's get a I've got it. I forgot we had that command. I love it. Um, do we go back and lock the thing on the share computer? No, I didn't. I oh my god, I should have done that. Okay, I need to remember to do that. I feel like I got distracted, especially by Tanaka during the nighttime. Okay, we're gonna take money and XP. Good teamwork, everyone. Now on to the next. Thanks, Aki. Um, there's a chest. Want to try opening it? Where the hell are the stairs? Oh, excellent. Looks like we can head up. I cannot believe we made it to the 100th floor. Yeah, we watched a documentary with Koro instead. And he loved it, and it was worth it. Oh. That shadow, it looks like there's something wrong with it. It's confused. Hmm. It seems to have be having trouble finding its footing. It's almost it almost looks drunk. 
They move slowly and are prone to missing their attacks. Okay. Yo, there's a shadow. All right, let's do this. The strong one, be on your plan? guard. Oh. Oh man. I think it's gonna resist this. Fuck! It healed! <clears throat> that sucks. Let's do this. Had a late night yet at the shadow bar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Another silver coin. Um, let's just use this. Sure. Thank you, Jack Brothers. You're so cute, me so. Hi, Chris. Welcome back. We're having some tartar sauce time. Ow. Owie, I just hit my finger on my desk. It's okay. Okay. Give me money and XP again. See, I feel like the thing about Tartarus now is that because we can get all these new Major Arcana cards, I feel like I need to be in here forever so I can actually like take advantage of having these cards, you know? Getting the extra XP, getting the extra money. I don't know if anyone else feels that way, but I'm like... <laughs> I don't want to leave. Jock, Fro Jock Frost, Jock Frost. <laughs> we love Jock Frost. <laughs> yeah, that's how you end up there for four hours, right? Uh oh. <laughs> Me when I'm a football player and <laughs> it's cold outside. Jock Frost. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, Mr. Fly, the loop. The loop of being in tartar sauce. Can you leave us alone, please? Let's see. God damn it. Nice. Hi, Monk Thomas. Welcome in. How are you? Now, how did we miss? Looks like you can target a weakness. <laughs> I love the way those enemies just fall on the floor. In Soul Hackers 2, there's a Melon Frost? What? Um. Okay, we're gonna take the Teardrop and XP. Nice. Just what we hope for. Girl, where the hell are the stairs? Oh, okay, here we go. Hello. Great. Is it C S Oh, I'm so sorry I'm gonna pronounce this wrong. CS get out. 
Is that it? Thank you for being high new. Welcome in. <laughs> Thank you for the follow as well. How are you doing today? Oops. Okay, let's recover. Oops. We've got a long climb ahead of us. Normally we need to bulk up for this expedition. Well in that case. There you go. That one's special. Take it down if you can. You called? Do it. I don't think I've ever heard um Mitsuru say that you called? Voice line. I like it. Where are you going, Miso? Oh no. Nice. Oh my gosh, Alexander! Thank you for the 10 stream watch streak. I appreciate it. Those emotes are so cute. And we got our Arcana Burst. Amazing. Um, and thank you so much for the mod love. You're doing fine, and you- I'm doing good too! Holy crap, what? Guys, this is crazy. So much XP for that. Holy crap. I feel like I need to be in here forever. <laughs> I'm never leaving Tartarus, you guys. <laughs> um, medium dark damage to all foes. Hmm. Let's get rid of this. Okay. Orpheus? Orpheus leveled up too! Let's go! <laughs> oh my god. Whoa. So yes, thank you so much for the tier one sub. I appreciate it. Enjoy emotes and your sub badge. Go on, Aki. My favorite is when she says, I won't miss, and then misses. Oh, man. Dude, ain't that a rare chest? <laughs> it's so nice. Nicely done. Ooh, sure. Thank you. Right, I don't want to fight that because we don't have Aki with us. That one looks like bad news. And I feel like we should have four people when we fight strong shadows like that. Okay. Yo. There you are. I went ahead and scout the area. Thank you. You've probably noticed the mineral chunks lying around. Supposedly, there are different types, some of which are quite rare. The rare ones give off a blue glow. They yield twilight fragments. Oh, um. yeah. I'm getting her. Oh, God, there's a door. There's a door on this floor. God damn it. Came to watch the grind. Thank you for being here. Are you, all, are you also playing Persona 3? We got ourselves a shadow here. Oh, brother. Go off, little guys. Hmm. <laughs> I guess we'll get more XP for this one. Sure. Y'all, we're leveling up so quick. Um... Oh, it's a clock thing. I think that takes seven Twilight Fragments? Holy shit, this is a big floor, what? This floor looks so different from all the other ones that we've been on. There's a treasure... Oops. Nice. Playing New Game Plus. Oh my gosh, amazing. Start following your series on YouTube. Awesome. Thank you for coming over from YouTube. I can't believe some of y'all are already doing New Game Plus. That blows my mind.
Okay, so there's one of those doors on this floor somewhere. Honestly, hmm. Let me see how many Twilight Fragments I have. Maybe it would be worth it to use this clock thing. Seven? Okay, we have 16 right now. Um. Let's see what SP items we have. fine <laughs> okay we're fine <laughs> it's a new game plus is crazy you need <laughs> to read fanfics or something <laughs> man again we were talking about this earlier i can't wait to go on ao3 when i'm done with this game you played this game yesterday now you don't know what to do oh my god so many of you are like already finishing the game that's craziness Let's go. Boots, you're riding a fig. Oh my god, this is so cute. Ready Come on, I'll show you. Can I ask what characters? You don't have to share if you don't want to. What's the plan here? Okay, let's do this. Man of right. P3 merch I'll finally be able to look at. Y'all, I've been eyeing up the, um... What's it called? The Nendo. The Makoto Nendo. It's so cute. I'm like, do I need that? <laughs> Feel like you shouldn't say it? Okay, no worries. It's so exciting though, it's so cute. Shock noise, what's that? Inflicts distress on all foes on the current floor? Girl, what the hell? That was excellent leadership. Thank you. Thank you so much. I know he's so tiny, Jimmy. He's so cute. Man. See, the thing is, there's just, there's so many Nendos I want. I just got the Akechi Nendo. Um, but I've also been eyeing the Apothecary Diaries Nendo. The one specifically of Jinshi. And then there's one of Mau Mau that I kind of want. <laughs> I'm like, I really don't need this. Also, y'all, I think they're making a Joker Nendo. They already have a Joker Nendo in his um, Phantom Thief outfit, but I believe they're making one in his Shujin outfit. Um, okay, let's take this and maybe the skill card. Just like we planned. Nice. Perfect. Just what we hoped for. There's a shadow. Hi, Scott Ray. Watch your shin play through. Now we tear up at work. Oh my god. Thank you for watching that. Yeah, what a what a game that was. There's an Igus Nendo. I did not know that. Or yourself a Mau Mau figure. I okay, I've been looking at Mau Mau figures too. I just I love Mau Mau. Yes, school at catchy too. Man. Okay, let's just do this. A catchy Nendo with his briefcase. <laughs> what just happened? Did we miss? Don't hold 
Magic, you have so many figures pre-ordered throughout the year. Oh man. Let's go. Oh my god, that did so much damage. Ice damage to all foes. There we go. Okay. Went off without a hitch. Let's get going. Sent the I guess Nendo in the JRPG channel. Okay, let me look at this. I feel like I'm slowly becoming a figure collector. Oh, <gasps> she is so cute! Oh my god, the I guess Nendo is adorable. Holy crap. Wait, did you say that that was available or is she still not available? A shadow. What will you do? I love it. I know an Aki Eco Nendo. I love that so much. Okay, ice. Time. Energy time. <laughs> Hi, Heartbreak. Welcome in. Me too. I love these songs so much. They did such a good job with the soundtrack. Yeah, Liz. I also feel like you're still like becoming a collector. It all started. It all started with my catchy figure, and then I was like, I need the P3 Collector's Edition because I want the figure that comes with that. And then I started getting Nendroids. And now I'm like, I want some Mau Mau figures. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> Hi, Mike. Playing P P5 Royal. I think you may need to play 3 Remake now. You really should. Um, I hope you're enjoying Persona 5. Persona 3 has been incredible. I would love to know how far you are in Persona 5. Is there really? Where's that door? I'm kind of lazy. I'm kind of lazy and I don't know if I want to go to that door. Let's just go up. Oh. Powerful enemy spot. Okay. Um. Let's, let's go save. Hmm. Maybe we should get more SP items. Alright, I feel like this is okay. We'll be good. Let me save again. Hi, Andrew, welcome in. Shuake, your first Nendos. I love it. Wait, Manda, have you ordered any more? Play the Makoto and Aegis and Shuake Nui Kichis. Oh my god. I pre-ordered the um the Akechi one. I remember people were freaking out when they finally dropped those uh Akechi Nui keychains. I also have Joker somewhere. Let me see if I can find him. Okay, I don't know where he is, but he's somewhere. He's somewhere in my office. <laughs> no, 
literally the Akechi Nendo drop. It was our Super Bowl. We were freaking out about it. You have a Jonker plush. Just hang up your mic. Oh, he's so cute. Honestly, I should have put him on here. I mean, I gotta find him. I think he's like under my blankets or something. Okay, let's go. Shoot, I should have done. Let's do this. I should have done Fuka's defense stuff. I'm itching for some action. Let's get rid of this one first. No mercy. Child's Go off, girl. Alright, it's frozen. That sucks. That really sucks. Yikes. Alright, there we go. Scarray, thank you for the prime sub! Enjoy your emotes and your sub badge. Hi, Remo, welcome in. Um, I have played Persona 4. Yes, I have. Uh, Mike, you're also in October in Persona 5. Amazing. Your second time. Oh, 100% in it. Okay, okay. Gotcha. Let's try fire. Oh shit, we can't do anything because we're paralyzed with fear. God. Holy shit. <laughs> um. Hmm. Increase party defense. Decrease all foes defense. Okay, let's try this. Hello, Virtue. The Slayus Persona. You need to stop that. <laughs> Arima, I'm doing good. How are you? Finding a boss right at the same time. Music is perfectly sing from your TV and in your headphones. I love it. I know the UI is so good. I love it so much. Okay, let's try this. Wow. Oh. Okay, we should use fire on that one. What's the plan? Um. You know what we could do? We could use ice break. <laughs> I could finally use ice break on this. Arima, I'm glad that you're doing well. You do UI stuff, thinking about how the implement is stressing me out. Oh my god. It's so cool though. Skyri, have you played like any any Persona games before? Because Persona 5 also has incredible menus and UI. I'm obsessed with it. Oh, that was good. Let's do this one. Jinta, you're so goofy. You're so silly. Nice. Easy peasy. 
Hi, Swagapito. I know, Reload soundtrack in April is so far away. I don't want this. Not bad. Excellent. A perfect victory. All thanks to your precise orders, baby girl. I'm just getting started. Oh? I admire your tenacity. That kind of drive will lead to further growth. Of course, I'll try to help out wherever I can. That said, please don't act recklessly. Now then, let's get back to business. Um, I don't know if I want to keep going. Recklessness for bravery. We're at level... 105? I feel like this is a good stopping point. We made it like... more than 10 levels today. Okay. Um, perhaps we fuse some personas since we do have the Lovers Arcana. The Lovers Arcana card. OG3, oh, you just picked up five actually. Oh, okay. To play in your Steam Bag. I hope you love them. They're so good. Yeah, I agree. Fours isn't bad either. I feel like they did a good job with four. Me so high. Are you here to sit in front of my monitor again? <laughs> Come here. Come here, Miso. He said no. Marvelous. Excuse me. Come near me, so. Y'all, Elizabeth is going to reduce the cost of summoning. Thank you. How may I assist That's so you? nice. Regis is overriding acceptable. All registered. No. Um, it is a special persona you desire, is it not? Well then. Okay, we're level we 39. Me so. <laughs> Can you stop that? I can't see anything when you sit right there, Miso. Seeing what personas come to be is a great joy. Come here. Of mine. Come here, you silly kitty. Sit down. Sit down. You're okay. You're fine. Oh, okay. Goodbye. <laughs> Hi, Gojira. How close are you to finishing this? I have no idea. Um, maybe like halfway through? More than halfway through? I don't know, to be honest. Alright, da Dakini? This persona is oh. I don't want to get rid of Kaguya. This would be a wise choice. Please choose what skills to inherit. Alright, let's take. This. 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 And maybe a lightning? It sure. Appears, it will receive a large well then. Shall we begin? You're ridiculous, me, so get your butt out of my face. Get your butt out of my face, me so. Filth is my power and therefore thine as well. To thee I offer mine. Be so you're, you're gonna make me scream. What are you doing? Uh, what's this? Restores. Wait, what? Oh, I have never seen this before. Me so. I'm so sorry, you guys. Fully restores party's HP. User's HP is reduced to one. That's kind of cool. I don't think I want this. Counter strike. Actually, you know what? I don't need this. Mr. Potential, thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate it. 
Me throwing away all Hama and Mundo skills. Yeah, are those all the insta kills, Astral? Um, Miso, can you stop? This persona is powerful. Can you stop, Miso? I'm gonna have to kick you out. I'm gonna have to kick you out, and I don't think you want that. Okay? Just sit here. Just sit here. It's okay. <laughs> just sit here. You're fine. Yeah, just a cat catting. I think he is hungry. What come to be is a great joy of mine. You're crazy. You're crazy, Kitty me so. Incubus. Oh, I don't like him. I don't like him. This persona is powerful. Oh, <gasps> Sendrion. She's so pretty. I don't want to get her a virtue though. King Frost. I feel like we should make King Frost and then we can summon Mothman back. Is this acceptable? Let's do that. What do you wish to inherit? Um It appears it will receive a good Yes. The king, I know the royal hee-ho. <laughs> Mikey, feed your corgi at 4 and she starts bugging you around. Yeah, 3:30. Yeah, Misa's very similar. Hee-ho, I'm King Frost. Your hee-fo is my hee-fo. I'll freeze everything in your way, ho. What a king. No, what are you doing, Miso? This increased party's defense? Jesus Christ. I don't know why, okay, I don't know if anyone else feels like this who's played Persona 5, but I feel like in Persona 5, it was really hard to find party moves like this. Like, increased party defense. Maybe it was just me, and I like didn't really know what I was looking for when I was fusing Personas. Um... Let's get rid of Ice Break. Okay. Let me see if I can get Miso out of here. He's gonna be really upset. One sec, you guys. I'm so sorry. Take all the time you need to consider. Personas come to be is a great joy of mine. Okay. <laughs> Lord. Reaper just showed up in your game, you panicked and <laughs> left a big locker room. Liz, no. I'm so sorry. Just so I didn't pay attention to buffs till like the final boss of P5R. Yeah, I like I didn't really know what I was doing in Persona 5. So maybe that's why I was like I didn't really notice if I did have any party defense or anything like that. It is a special <gasps> persona. This would be a wise choice. Oh my gosh, we have to do this. 
We have to do this. Okay, so we're gonna make Black Frost, and then we need to summon back Mothman and King Frost. All right. Yes. Please choose what skills to inherit. Let's take. Oh. Hmm. What is Matara? Oh, I love that party attack. <laughs> Choose what skills okay. to inherit. Let's take fire. Um wind damage? Because I feel like we don't really have a lot of wind damage. Um this. And how about freeze boost? Sure. It, appears it will receive a good amount of extra. It's finally time. I had to loop the reaper on a pillar because there was a big chest. <laughs> I was panicking so much. <laughs> See, I feel like it wouldn't be bad if you were like, I don't know, level 80 something. But when you're early in game, it's scary. Hey ho, I'm an almighty black frost. I'll teach you he how to walk and talk like a badass ho. Okay. What a slayer. I love him. Oh, this is a full arcana. Heavy, f oh, heavy fire damage. Okay. Heavy ice damage, bitch. What the hell? Nice. Okay. Um. Registering, I see. This is your problem. Let's so get far. King Frost back and Mothman. Hi, Trev. Welcome back. Oh my God, y'all. This is gonna be expensive. Does that persona? Elizabeth, I thought you reduced the prices. Okay, wait. Are you in search of? It is a special persona. You well then. Shall we take a look? I'm stressed out. <laughs> okay, I'm so sorry. Maybe we don't. Maybe we don't get King Frost and... Huh? What's this? <laughs> no, literally it's a 1% discount. <laughs> oh, you appear to be harboring a new potential. The personas you've acquired are resonating with one another, elevating you to greater heights. Hello? King and I, heavy ice damage all foes? Slay? Okay, let's leave. Yeah, a new synergy! Ooh, I'm excited! Good day. Do we finish any of your requests? Test? Perform King and I. Let's hear the results. House the king of all Jack Frost, together with a Jack Frost who has obtained sinister <laughs> powers. The mischief wrought by these two will surely be of great aid for you. I can't wait to see that. Wonderful. <gasps> with the acquisition of the marionette, you can now fuse Neveros, the necromancer from hell. God damn. Let's hear the results. Cool. By all means. Very well. Okay, let me save here. I feel like that was a good Tartarus run. Oh, hello. Yes, let's call it quits. I think we made it to level 105. It's pretty good. Makoto's jacked. Makoto's pumped. <laughs> good morning. This is Elizabeth. Stop. Is she gonna be like, there are humans that just wandered into Tartarus. I know you're just there, but you're gonna have to go back. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. Great timing. Thank you so much, what? Elizabeth. Please swiftly and safely conduct a search and God damn it. Every time. Every single time. I know. That's tragic. 
<laughs> that person can stay there. Listen. <laughs> they can just hang out. It's fine. You know who is okay? Fuku is fine. Other people will be okay too. Hiraga, hello. Ooh, okay. Who should we hang out with? Hayase? Maybe we hang out with Hayase. Let me go see what everyone else is doing. K-Slay, real. Hayaslay. <laughs> I'm sorry. This dorm was built some time ago, so the air conditioning unit doesn't work very well. It's usually tolerable, but today, I can understand why Aori is griping so much. Oh, man. Why? Damn, it's hot. Why is it so hot inside, too? Help, I'm melting. I am... I understand that. Y'all, in my college dorm, we had no AC. Hey, little guy. We had no AC in my college dorm. It was horrendous. Never want to experience that again. <laughs> Let's go hang out with, um... What's his face? Ma Mamoru? Mamoru? You're the star, Arcana. Do we have a star? <gasps> no, but we have so many fool Arcanas. What the hell? Okay, we need to go to the velvet room. That is so where you went to school coded. Yeah, definitely expect noisy. Mm-hmm. Well, like... Honestly, if you had AC at your, in your college dorms, I would be really surprised. If you live in the Midwest. <laughs> I feel like... I never hear of anyone in the Midwest who had AC in their dorms. I don't know. Unless you lived in, like, a newer building. Astral, thank you for adding that command. The coral pet, good boy. You had AC, Trev. Well, I'm jealous. This is your progress so far. So bizarre to not have AC. Yeah, you're in Texas though, Astra. I feel like if y'all did not have AC in your dorms, um, people would die. <laughs> and then here in Wisconsin, we just suffer a little bit for like, I don't know, two or three weeks. All right, we're gonna take a uh, Neko Shogun. Are you finished? We look. I think if we didn't have AC in our dorms, there would be a revolt. Mm -hmm. Yeah, people would die. It's like basements. Oh my god, Astro, that's right. We have basements here in the Midwest. And in Texas, y'all don't. See, that is so strange to me. Because I'm like, where do you store your stuff? I don't know. What are basements, Astral? Are you serious? Yeah. In the garage? That's why everyone parks on the street? Oh my god. <laughs> we park in the garage because otherwise if we don't... Oh. All right. I'm getting fancy today and adding an egg to my order. He's so fancy. <laughs> Listen. We park in the garage because if we don't park in the garage, then our cars are going to be covered in snow. And then we would have to leave the house 30 minutes early so we could wipe the snow off our cars and then defrost our windows and scrape the ice off our windows. Hello, lips. <laughs> His lips are pronounced. Mamoru lips highest lay. <laughs> Ooh, that hit the spot. You get a lot of bang for your buck here. Man, can't remember the last time I had such a fresh egg. Who says that? I can't remember the last time I had such a fresh egg. Maybe I should get some for them too. Them? The people helping you? Oh my 
my siblings. I've got four younger ones. Oh. Our apartment's pretty small though, so we're packed like sardines. Hi, say. Um. Oh God, I don't know what he wants to hear here. Sounds like fun. Sounds rough. I don't like any of these. Sounds rough. <laughs> you could say that. You wouldn't believe how hot it gets in the summer. I never mentioned this, but my father died five years ago. Guys, is there ever a character in this game that has both parents? I don't think so. You were told this car fell off a cliff. I'm not fishing for sympathy or anything. I, I just thought you should know. Hi, as they told me about his family situation, he's going through some tough times. My guy. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, Maiko does. Maiko has both parents. Oh, it's already this late. The preschool's gonna be letting out soon. He, ha he has to go pick up his siblings. Mm. Man. Give us the highest day romance. Memorial Love boy kiss her highest day. <laughs> Damn, it's hot. I'm sweating like a pig over here, man. Yeah. Stay strong, Yuri. The heat will only affect you if you allow it to. Mitsuru. <laughs> I don't know if that's how it works. Of course. Okay, okay. Of course, there are limits to that theory. <laughs> <laughs> oh, brother. Yes, yeah, that's someone with ice power. For real. Y'all, we're getting to um, 60 hours. 60 hours in the game. This is crazy. I'm going to go to the antique, sh antique store. I would like to see if I could craft anything. Reminds me. You know of Club Escapade? I heard there I heard through the grapevine that the owner there has been collecting gemstones as a hobby. <sighs> Good grief. What's he even going to do with them? I could get so much more use out of them. Yes. Huh. Okay. Which one? You've come at a good time. There are some new items you can create. <sighs> Ooh, that's pretty good. Rock dog suit. I feel like we need to get this. Sure? Yeah. There you go. Thanks for waiting. Are you sure? Here you go. Thanks for waiting. So, what will it be? Please bring the required. What would you like? Hmm. Okay. Go on, look around. I'm sure this will prove to be useful. Hmm. Everything good? Woman is mother. No, literally, this lady. I love her. <laughs> also, high words. And Jeff, hello. Yeah, heat's not real. It can't hurt you. Mm -hmm. Rebirth, yeah, is coming after Persona. Okay, so. again. Um, so she said something about the like, sky and Club Escapade. I don't know if that was supposed to like tip me off to go talk to them. Hey. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome. I guess he is selling this stuff. Holy crap, we have so much of that. Okay. Um, I should go sell the stuff that I got from Tartarus. <laughs> Contras! <laughs> Please. I'm doing good, Wars. I hope you are too. 
What'd you bring? Wanna sell? All right. Yes. I'll take that. All done here. Goodbye. Come back soon. I'm so sorry. I'm like not buying any weapons from you anymore. So I would rather upgrade. Okay, what's over here? No. Maybe we should go hang out with. Oh my god, wait, let's go hang out with Akiko. Okay, we're gonna do that. I'm so sorry, Yukari. Hey. I'm about to run out of my protein packed food stock. If you aren't busy, wanna help me make more? What? What? He won't gain the Let's skill see. set. What about Yukari? What do we do? I, I want to hang out with Aki, <laughs> even though it's kind of pointless. Um. <laughs> we're gonna do it. Okay, we're gonna do it. <laughs> Chelsea's gonna have a breakdown. <laughs> Listen, it's okay. Look at him. Eggs are essential for building a healthy body. And there's no better choice than chicken. This guy just does not stop talking about chicken. This should last a while. Let's put it in the freezer. No. Let me just... What the hell is that? Brother, oh brother, how do I, how do I fit the screen? There we go. Oh wow. Mmm. I think it might be boiled chicken. Uh huh. No seasoning. Yum. A super athlete meal. Mmm. Thanks for always helping out. Let me know when you want some more. Thanks, Aki. He's eating like an alpha! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh. Yeesh, he's a scorcher. Oh man, it's already the 20th? Summer break's almost over. Not that I got anything to do. You think with special powers, the rest of the world wouldn't be so... What's up, Junpei? <gasps> it's Coquette Girl! What's she doing? Drawing? She's some kind of caricature artist? Nah, no way. There's no one around for her to draw. Why are you drawing? What the heck is she drawing then? There's nothing interesting here. Out of the way. <laughs> You're blocking my view. Move. <laughs> huh? Oh, sorry. Oh, what's with those funky colors? What do you want? No, uh, nothing. My bad. Dude, how can she stand to wear that crazy outfit in this heat? No, seriously? I would be sweating up a storm. And what was up with that weird drawing? But what is she drawing? I guess beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Junpei said, that was kind of ugly. <laughs> huh. Oh well. Poor girl in the dress. Man. Summer vacation is starting to wind down. Meat. Meat. I don't want to hang out with you. We have a mask! Oh my god, we have a Featherman mask! Fun! I love that! Thursday? Unironically, she's so cunty. Need someone to cosplay her? I would love to. I feel like it'd be really hard <laughs> to cosplay her, though. Actually, maybe not. I don't know. 
I guess you just need a, a white frilly dress like that. Who are you? Oh. Catnip? <gasps> Give it to one of the cats of the strip mall. Okay, I can do that. Wanna cosplay her? Why don't you have her makeup look? You should, Manda. Oh my god. Yeah, gothic lolita fashion. I like it. A red wig too. Got reddish hair. Me? Me? I feel like it's all gone, my red hair. <laughs> In a dress. Maybe after after the game I can look up look up cosplays for her. Or I can just try and find white dresses like hers and see. I was thinking about cosplaying Fuka because Fuka her um her like spring outfit it's like a blue turtleneck. And then I have a white button-up or like white tie cardigan that looks exactly like her. I'm like, hmm, I could do that. That'd be easy. This cat-loving boy. I tried putting on cat ears, but the cats still won't even look at me. Maybe if I had a cat, to a cat toy, I don't think I have enough to buy one. You can have this. Imagine Makoto is like. <laughs> This is for my cat. We don't have a cat. You can have this cat ear headband. I don't need it anymore. <gasps> Elizabeth would like this headband! Oh my god, Elizabeth in cat ears? Oh, hi. So, have you finished all your homework already? I lost it. The teacher's not gonna buy the excuse, you know. You'll end up working on a new assignment after class. And if that happens, you won't be able to go to Tartarus. It's such trouble to take care of it now. Yeah. Cosplay all of season, Photoshop them all in a dollar picture. Fukulana Friday. Oh my god. Marvelous. Thank you. Here are my rec Let's hear the result. Oh my. <laughs> I, didn't, I did not think that there would be a nose too. She says meow. <laughs> I see. Wearing this will transform you into a cat in the blink of an you eye. My thanks. Thank you for this lovely gift. Now I too can become a straw millionaire. I don't get it. <laughs> 20? 20 turquoise? <laughs> the meow. Very well then. Uh, the French meow. That's so funny. Perhaps we go hang out with our grandparents. Star yes, that's right, Stardew. Stardew, I just saw on my break, um, 1.6 is coming out. I, I really wonder what they're gonna have in 1.6. I'm really excited for that. Legend of the Straw Millionaire, also known as Daitsu or Daikokumai, is a Japanese Buddhist folktale about a poor man who becomes wealthy through a series of successive trades. Starting with a- Oh, a single piece of straw! Okay, we traded a bunch. We traded a bunch with people and then eventually got those cat ears. I get it. I get it now. Gonna be a, a hefty update? Yeah, because 1.5 was... I think 1.5 in Stardew, they added like a... Didn't he add a whole new area? Maybe not. Welcome to the velvet La room. <laughs> Manda. <laughs> Please. Um, also, thank you for the follows. I appreciate that. Oh, adding pronouns to Stardew. I think I did see that. Y'all, I haven't played Stardew in so long. I'm kind of like, hmm. Maybe I should start a new 
new farm. Please take a look. Okay, we need a hero font persona. Let's take Shisa. This person is this acceptable? Sure. May it be your inner strength. Very well. We look Okay. Trying hard to finish this by Wednesday night. Oh, for like in preparation for rebirth, is that why? Said it was gonna be a lot bigger than people originally anticipated. Yeah, seeing a whole new area. I hope so. That'd be so cool. So just a certain new save. What? Oh, you can filter your personas. Oh, okay, okay. I will remember that. 1.6 introduces war. Introduces war, and not in my Stardew. <laughs> Sure hope not. <laughs> Thank you for the hundred bits. I appreciate that. <laughs> Yay, our relationship will grow stronger soon. Oh my god, my bit alerts. <gasps> Why are you whining? No. Does he want treats? No means no. <laughs> what? What's wrong? I am currently negotiating with Koromaru-san. Koromaru-san is prohibited from going out for a walk Aww. on his own. There were arrangements for Sonata-san to accompany Koromaru-san on his walk today. Well, where is he? However, the scheduled time has passed, and Sonata-san has yet to return. Koromaru-san's patience has reached its limit. Do you think he's... Do you think he's going to see his boyfriend? Or his ex, I should say? Listen, Koro, we can go take you on a walk. Koromaru-san is requesting that you accompany him instead. Are you available to assist at the moment? Okay. What about you, I guess? My current mission is to remain on standby at the dormitory. I'm afraid I'm fully occupied at the moment. Okay. I must also request your assistance. Cora's <laughs> little smile is so cute. Oh. Human persona user. Now that is certainly unique. Intimidating voice. What the fuck is that? Oh. However, <laughs> it's just the quink. Okay. <laughs> Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> There's no need for hostility. Now is hardly the time. Is he a vampire? Let's have a little chat. Come along. At the shrine? He doesn't seem to be hostile, which they do. What exactly are you waiting for? <laughs> now then, I have a question. Can you get your hand off your gun? Cause <laughs> you look like you're just gonna take it out and shoot me. However, just demanding answers from you wouldn't be a very fair arrangement, now would it? I will answer one question of your own first. So, what do you want to know? Everything. Why aren't you wearing a top? <laughs> I have to ask this. Why aren't you wearing a top? That's the most important question we have. <laughs> My coat is invisible to fools. Stop. He's actually wearing a coat. You're lying. You're lying about that. <laughs> but of course I'm joking. Okay. <laughs> okay. Chappy, thank you for the 15th stream watch streak. Welcome in. What a surprise that you would rather ask about me instead of our group. 
I mean... Perhaps this is a sign that we may reach a mutual understanding. Oh. In the beginning, we had no quarrel with you. Had you not decided to eliminate the Dark Hour, we wouldn't have had a reason to interfere. It is truly unfathomable. The power of a persona is a blessing granted only to us. Yet, you insist on ending the Dark Hour, knowing full well that your powers will be lost. Dude, the, the world's literally gonna end if we don't... Now, answer me this. Why? Are you trying to protect the world from the shadows? Uh, we can't just ignore them. Is that truly how you feel? Cupid? Cupid? <laughs> I'm gonna scream. No. Not to cry. I know Makoto's still thinking about the coat. Mm -hmm. He's like, I wonder if he actually wasn't joking about the coat. What if he actually does wear it? In this country, almost 5,000 people die in car accidents Oh god, not this. Year. Not this argument. And yet, there is no outcry against the existence of cars. Why do you suppose that is? It is because we value our own convenience over the lives of others. So then, why should we give up the powers we were bestowed? Takaya, that makes no sense. Do you know what a savior complex is? You are being trapped by a misguided way of thinking. We have no obligation to sacrifice what is ours to save others. Giving up your own life to save others is simply a waste. Your reason for fighting is one of obsession. I don't think it is though. You're wrong. Do you continue to deny it because you can't accept the truth? There is no need to rush your decision. You should think carefully about it. We have been given a special power. And yours... Yours is particularly extraordinary. He's just so weird to me. Yeah, he said we live in a society. He's essaying. <laughs> I just... Why does he not wear a top? What's the little headband around his head? You're so weird, Takaya. It's as if the Dark Hour has chosen you. Okay, listen. With this, and then with with um ikuchi at the beginning of the stream who's like it's kind of like you were made to be here mm. i don't know i'm mm, i don't know does it I'm really scared. make sense for you to reject this gift that was all i had to say tonight is a new moon you have ample time to reconsider before the moon waxes full again Uh, uh. Paper? With that, my debt to you is paid. Perhaps it might help you make up your mind. Girl, what is this? Well then, I shall be going. I trust you'll have changed your tune by the next time we meet. <laughs> it's a folded up piece of paper. There's something written on it. Piece of paper from Takaya. The new gear has eased summoning, but we need to make new safety cartridges before handing them off to MK. The evoker weight is also an urgent matter. Fortunately, ample test subjects remain to... MK. Mitsuru Kirijo. Or, I don't know what her father's first name is.
Help me. Help me, Junpei. I can't believe that Strega guy went to the shrine too. And why was he half naked? Is it because it's summer? <laughs> Makoto's like... No, I'm just imagining... What Makoto told the group. And then he said I could ask him one question. And so I asked him why he never wore a shirt. And then the whole group goes, oh my god. <laughs> One of the members of Strega seems to have taken an interest in you. Sometimes a malicious human being can be more dangerous than a shadow. If you cross paths, I want you to be careful. Lord. Yeah, I've not played Persona 3 before. I have a suggestion. Unlike the large shadows, it's difficult to predict where Strega will appear next. Koromaru san said that we must be very cautious of them. Hi, Koro. What do you. You want to be brushed? <laughs> Koromaru just wants to be brushed. I'm gonna cry. I'm sorry we can't brush you. I was gonna go on the computer. I'm just gonna go with the computer. <laughs> okay, I feel like we have to. <laughs> I can't not. <laughs> I'm so sorry, you guys. <laughs> I was gonna... Yeah, go play Final Fantasy XIV. <laughs> no, we're gonna brush him. Cause my... When else can we do this? I can always go on the computer. I can go on tomorrow. He's so cute. He said, why the hell did you stop? <laughs> it seems like Karamara still wants me to keep brushing him. <laughs> Where should I brush next? Oh my god. <laughs> What's that? A Twilight Fragment? Oh! A Soul Refresh. What a good dog! I love him so much. He's so happy. Koromaru is very happy. <laughs> I love him. He's a sweet baby boy. If you stop petting him, he looks at me and starts swatting. Angie, that's like Miso. Sometimes I'll be petting Miso and then I'll stop and he'll like grab my hand and start biting it. I'm like, sir, you need to stop this. Summer's almost over. I can't believe it. Summer break's almost over. Why's it gotta end? Haiku by Yuko Nishiwaki. <laughs> Oh my god, we can get a max rank with grandparents. Alright. Well, I think I need to end stream. Time flies, you guys. It's been six and a half hours. How's it been six and a half hours? I don't know. Well, Viking, thank you for the 100 bits. Top of the Sky feels a bit like how eccentric European bad guys are portrayed in bad American movies. <laughs> He's topless even in the winter. <laughs> Real. Oh lord. Actually, let me talk to everyone first. It certainly is hot, this place. Even outside of training, this is a temperature where if you don't make sure you hydrate, you'll collapse. True. Hmm. I never realized how expensive clothes are. Yukari-san left one of her magazines out, so I got curious and flipped through it. Some clothes look the same, but their price tags are totally different. Hmm, trendsetters sure have it hard, don't they? What are you talking about? <laughs> it's so hot. 
I want to eat something that's ice cold. Someone bring me ice cream, please. Yeah, Junpei this whole time has been complaining about the heat and he keeps eating these hot ramen noodles. Okay, let me save y'all. Thank you so much for hanging out. What a fun day. Yeah, good ass persona today. I feel like we made good progress. We went through Tartarus. It was a lot of fun. Um, did some social links. We did my first max rank with Tanaka. Love, love Tanaka. <laughs> We're gonna find someone to raid though. If you would like to stick around with the raid, I would appreciate it. Uh, let me see who's online. Yes, 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 yes. We're gonna go raid Amy. Amy is currently playing Persona 5. Well, she's gonna start playing Persona 5. Um. I think she might be going to the fifth palace. I, I'm not sure if that's correct, but I think she's somewhere like post fourth palace. But thank you all so, so much for hanging out. Big shout out to my mods, say it mods. I love you all so much. Um, let's go say hi to Amy. If you would like, you can copy the raid message and then paste it in Amy's chat when we get over there. Send her a bunch of love. I'm gonna be live again on Wednesday at 10 a.m. and we'll be playing more Persona, uh, making our way through August. We have 15 days until next full moon. It's kind of crazy, but I appreciate y'all. I hope you had a lovely Monday. Have a good rest of your Monday. Have a great start to your week. And let me copy this and say bye to all of you. Oh god, can I copy this? Here we go. Jeff, thank you so much for posting that uh, social command. Just Darian, thank you so much for being here. Uh, Alicia, thank you. Trev, thank you. Mr. Fly, Magic, Raz. Um, I thought Gamer, thank you so much for the 10 bits. No, 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 no worries. Um, Astral, thank you. Raz, Trev, Luna, QB, Nina, Jeff, um, Commonly. Uh, Jay, thank you, CBK, Cupid, Manda, Giselle, Astra, Chelsea, Liz, um, anyone who I missed, I'm so sorry if I did not say bye to you. Just hope, thank you for being here. Thank you for the mod love. AFL, thanks for hanging out. Edson, thank you. Um, Hugh, thank you. Yes, thank you for putting that, Nina. That's, there's the link to Toffee in case you get left behind. But I will see you all later. And take care and send Toffee your love. Okay, goodbye, everyone. Bye, bye, bye.